Okay, welcome everybody. Uh, I'm really excited for Tears of the Kingdom, so I wanted to replay Breath of the Wild, but uh, that game can be very long. So I decided I'm going to do something I still have never tried doing this game, which is basically trying to kill Ganon as soon as possible. Hi, I'm Voidburger. I'm here too. Hey. <laughs> Eating a sandwich. Uh, I started replaying some older Zelda games. I played through all of Twilight Princess, which is better than I remember it, but still very by the numbers. Thanks to the bits, Leon Rez. I don't know if uh, something funny played, but do tell me if something funny played or not. Just for 100 bits, I don't think so. There are multiple 100-bit ones, but you have to, like, specifically do it. Mm-hmm. The big boy. Oh, the big boy. <laughs> Here comes the big boy. Uh, and I played, I've been playing a little bit of Skyward Sword because there's strangely a lot of like Skyward Sword influence in this game. Skyward Sword hey, tried to do a bunch of things of and eyes. Breath of the Wild took all those and did them better mm. here. Wake up, Link. I still don't like her voice actress. Mm -hmm. I just can't shake it. Uh, and if this game, for some reason, seems to look better than it should, it's because I have uh, the Switch 2. That's right, the Super Switch. <gasps> we have a Switch, the we, sequel to we the have, Switch? We have a Super oh, Switch, yeah. Wow. Yeah, I stole it from Giant Bomb right before I got uh, let off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And that's now why that's they're in Nintendo jail. I stole the Switch 2 yep. right before I got booted out the door. Uh, it's fully backwards compatible with every single Nintendo platform ever. So if you've got an NES cart, you can just jam it right in there and it works. <laughs> um... See, so yeah, I can get through the Great Plateau pretty quickly. I, Ooh, I will. Leon Rez gifting ten tier one subs. Ooh. Holy guacamole! Thank you. Thank you. I don't know what your sub sound is. Uh, I forgot already. <laughs> is it cool. Hmm? Slate? Take it. It will help guide you after your long slumber. Oh, it's the codec. Okay, cool. Yep, yep. So Link is really ready to go save Zelda. He's not going to fart around at no. all. No. So I will clarify, I'm not using like any crazy speed running techniques. Oh, we got to kick it from the side. <laughs> oh, good start to the run. Uh, and then we also need to punch a chest from the side, too. Oh, I forgot <laughs> about that one. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry if you hear all the clicky clacks from my controller. I'm using a Series X controller, which is just like that. Um, yeah, I'm not doing any speed run shit. I don't really know how to do any of the speed run shit. I do not know how to stand on a tree log and make it throw me all the way to the final boss fight. Yeah, the only one I know about is the one that Grub was using to cheat uh, in uh, the Hyrule Hustle, which was like you you whistle. Oh, you whistle so you can run forever. And you run like fast forever. Yeah, that was a thing I remember people found on like day one because everyone was just like, <laughs> I want to run forever. <laughs> Link, you are the light. Thank you. Light. Wow. Shine upon no pressure. <laughs> I really Thank don't you. like her voice actress. I think she sounds a little like someone doing a bad impression of Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> but unlike, I don't think she's that bad. Unlike Come ludes on. or something. Like, really tired. Like, I don't know. Like, I just don't like it. Mm-hmm. I like the Japanese voice actor. <laughs> yeah. Not to be a huge weeb about it, but. Uh, yeah, I do agree that the Japanese voice acting is better. 
though, I've also played... I played the, through the DLC stuff in Japanese. Mm -hmm. But I figured I'd just do English, because maybe people are just kind of listening to this on the side and stuff, so, you know. No, that's a good idea, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, was Ada's voice weird in the RE4 remake, someone says? It's not great. Mm. <coughs> That's a shame. I feel but like also she got super great. harassed for not being great. Oh, no. Which uh, fucking sucks. That stinks. Wow, not picking up that stick. Bold move. I Bold don't. move starting out. It's going to break in three hits. Four <laughs> hits. So... I also still have a lot of muscle memory from having way more stamina, so I'm going to try not to constantly... <laughs> make my boy get really tired. Mm -hmm. uh, also, every once in a while, the game might stutter because that's how emulation works on this. It's got to compile shaders, and I've made it... I've tried to make it compile as many shaders as possible, but there's mm -hmm. tens of thousands of them. Looks pretty nice to me. I'm just going to avoid him. Bye. I thought you needed to talk to him. You do not. Huh. You're not going to take his apple? <laughs> no. God. <laughs> Oh, I just gotta let this happen. <laughs> oh, is this all gonna bother you? Oh, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> After you named all the Final Fantasy VII characters dumb fucking names. <laughs> Hopefully not. Hopefully this won't bother me. Thanks, bud. So, people just tuning in, there is gonna be an extra gimmick to this that won't really start until... We are done with the Great Plateau, but I have a... So basically, I'm trying to go, after finishing with the Plateau, going straight to Ganon and trying to kill him, uh, you know, while not getting any armor or anything. But every time I die trying to get to Ganon, I will have to spin a big roulette wheel that has, like, 50 different tasks on it, and then I have to do that task before I can go make another attempt on Ganon. Mm -hmm. And we brainstormed all these 50 things yeah. together. We weighed them differently, so some are rare and some are more common. Uh, I will clarify, this is just tasks. There are no, like, penalties or anything. It's just, like, do a thing. Link. Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah Slate. <laughs> How many slots on the wheel are make a pizza? <laughs> there is one cooking thing. <laughs> A single cooking thing. Yep. Because, <laughs> I mean, it's gonna, he's going to be cooking anyway, but this is yeah. like a cook a specific thing that's a little annoying to do. Mm-hmm. Um, Drive by apple pluck. <laughs> that's some tech. So this is a game. I fucking love this game a, a shit ton. The, it this rules. game's incredible. <laughs> and I've also never replayed this game because it was so fucking good that I didn't want to, like... Really? Yeah, I didn't want to get rid of the, like, the kind of mystery feeling of the map by playing it over and over and over. Mm -hmm. I mean, I played Master Mode, but I didn't like beat it on Master Mode. Yeah. Really, the Great Plateau is the hardest part of Master Mode, and once you get off the plateau, it's like, oh, okay, yeah. I'm just like, recalibrating everything else from here on out, but it's not that hard. Right. Hard, hard. That being said, I didn't get like all the way through. Yeah. So I don't know if it gets significantly worse. I'm very curious to see how this game's going to feel when I'm not doing absolutely everything I see. Because, like, yeah, like you said, the game starts off hard. Mm. But it's, you can exceed the difficulty curve so quickly if right. you're, like... Yeah, I think my only, like, criticism of Breath of the Wild is that the difficulty curve is non-existent once you figure out the first, like, big bump of it. It's also just because and if that's you start... the nature of the game, though. Like, yeah. like the, the ability to go anywhere and do anything. Unfortunately, that's just a side effect of that. And really, I, I th don't know how that can be helped. So. I think a big part of it, too, is also just the fact that you can upgrade your armor and just take so little damage after a certain point. Mm. By the way, why aren't we streaming Parasite Eve? You had an, you had an itch that you wanted to scratch with this. Yeah. I just, just there's, wanted to address that. <laughs> we there, haven't forgotten about, about yeah, Parasite. Yeah, we're going to get back to it. I was really fucking busy with work for like two weeks in a row, basically. Uh, and yeah, I just have a big itch right now for Breath of the Wild. Mm -hmm. 
And also, like, this game's really big, so I gotta start a couple weeks before Tears of the Kingdom comes out if I want to have any chance of <laughs> getting mm. through it. Mm -hmm. Can you skip cutscenes like this, or are they all mandatory first time you see them? I think you can skip cutscenes. These cutscenes. But I want to see the cutscenes. Okay, I I'm, thought we I'm, were trying to be fast. Oh my god. Go to Ganon. It's not, it's not like full speed run mode. It's a far walk, is what I'm saying. Well, I think the skeleton lich guy is still going to show up pretty prominently, even though we've got Big Daddy Ganondorf. Mm hmm. You mean Tears of the Kingdom? Yeah. Yeah. Also, they might be two separate guys for all we know. Might mm -hmm. be an ancestor of Ganondorf. Yeah. Every hundred years, like, a new king of the of God the is born. It's <laughs> There's two Ganondorfs this time. What if that? Yeah. What if? Why not? It's his grandpa. <laughs> grandpa Dorf. Mm -hmm. I remember eating a rock with a Goron. I had a stomach full of rocks. <laughs> and then I had to take a big sleep. I had to sleep it off. Mm -hmm. When the beast regains its true power, this world will face its end. Cool guy. Now then. Do you want any sandwich bits of left no. over? No. Okay. You must hurry, Link. I'm a baby who who cuts off the crusts Before of my sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> no warning signs. <laughs> I could have been autistic until uh -huh. recently. No way to know. Uh -huh. Oh, maybe. Could be. Mm. I was just like, oh, it's a quirk. <laughs> Oops. This is just a large pile of quirks, I think. Yeah. So yeah, he, you know, I did skip the old man at the start, but after you have this tower come up, he does still go like, hey, crazy, huh? Forget about somebody. Plug in my laptop, but I gotta find a cord. Mm. Yeah, apparently, I don't know how verified it is, but I did see on Twitter earlier today that there is supposedly some leaked copies of Tears of the Kingdom out there, and I'm trying. I'm just. I'm not looking at any message boards anymore. Are you like gonna mute some words? I don't know if I'll go that far. Maybe. I don't know. I guess it depends on how verified it gets and like how bad the leaks are. You know, if it's suddenly just like, oh, someone's got the final boss, here comes, you know, it's mm. like, ah, oh, fuck. Mm. Gotta mute the word the now. <laughs> That's only gonna make Twitter more usable than it currently is. <laughs> yeah. You do not need to show me anything, old man. I know where to go. <laughs> oh. 
Ah. Ah, Zelda. I love Zelda. Zelda. <laughs> Zelda. <laughs> oh yeah, YouTube thumbnails are gonna spoil the end game boss like day one. Yep. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I got the DLC chests here. Okay. delicious sandwich. I'm, I'm glad you had your sandwich. Were you fade in there? I was a little, actually. Yeah. And I had gummy vitamins. I'm fully powered up. Wow. <laughs> Peter Neal. Doop, 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 doop. It was peanut butter jelly. <laughs> <laughs> was the chat asking you, or was it just like... No <laughs> chat asked me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was waiting for the fanfare to end for okay. me to go, yeah, it was peanut butter jelly. <laughs> sure. <laughs> like a child. <laughs> Strawberry jelly, not grape. Mm-hmm. My friend is very militant about grape jelly. Mm-hmm. But you know what? That's just one of the... One of our beautiful differences. <laughs> shit out of here. <laughs> I whipped it. Oops. Ow. Forgot. I guess it'd go up higher. <laughs> Peanut butter preference, smooth, and also jiff. Could be not it can be nothing but jiff, right? I mean I dealt I dealt with the the store brand during pandemic because mm -hmm. like groceries were all fucked up, mm -hmm. shipments were all fucked up for a while. But I didn't like it. <laughs> yeah. Skippy can fuck off. Peter Pan, <laughs> I don't know him. Get out of here. I am still very used to the thirty hours of. Twilight Princess controls, so I'm fucking everything up. <laughs> you seem fine to me. Every time I uh, see those those doors you go past, I am reminded of that one clip that like got posted day one of somebody opening those doors too fast, hitting themselves in the face, and, oh, and, dying. and killing themselves. Yep. Yep. Do we have craft peanut butter in America Land? I don't think we do. No? Same craft that does the mac and cheese? The terrible mac and cheese? Mm -hmm. Speaking of craft, their headquarters are where we live. Ugh. They have a big plastic macaroni outside, and yeah. it says, you know you want it. <laughs> yeah. On the macaroni, on the big fiberglass macaroni that's like the size of a car. Mm hmm. You know you want it. <laughs> <laughs> Pair glider, please. Yeah, I don't know if it's like the headquarters headquarters, but it is one of the headquarters. It's one of them, yeah. There's probably more than one. It's a pretty big company. <laughs> Thanks for subbing one hell of a burrito. <laughs> and indeed you are. Tom Break, yes. I love Oh These, Those Stars of Space. And I made a little playlist. I curated a little playlist for Chip mm -hmm. to get him into it on when he took a long drive up to Michigan. Like a five, six hour drive. Damn it. <laughs> I was like, boy, do I have something for you to pass the time with. I thought these would break if you dropped them. I think you have to explode them. Oh, okay. There you go. <laughs> Not forceful enough. <laughs> mm. 
But yeah, in in lieu of um, Rude Tales of Magic, my favorite favorite podcast on earth, having a bit of a hiatus. It's been a couple months since they did a uh, episode. Has it really been that long? It, actually, yeah, it's been like uh, two months or something. Wow. Eh, what are you gonna do? These things happen. Uh, in lieu of that, I was like, I guess I should get into the other podcast that has mm-hmm. all of these really funny people on it. Like and a- guess what? It's also fucking really good too, because those same people are still really good. Yeah, and they have like a huge amount of episodes out. Mm hmm. They got like 50 or something episodes of that. It's easier for those to get made, I guess. Mm hmm. Because they're like episodic. They're like. You yeah, know, like, you, don't you don't need have to have a... a plot or like consistent characters. You know, it's it's great. Yep. Mm-hmm. I'm only doing some of this stuff at the start just because I want to make sure I have like some stuff on me. Mm-hmm. You gotta have a little, little bit of some of them. Because I think there's like ice arrows and fire arrows in these chests, which are very it handy. Sounds familiar. <laughs> Look yeah. at him. Look at him. Only played it once. Remembers <laughs> where the fire and ice arrows are. Look at this boy. Yeah. Oh, and I'm weird for cutting the crusts off my bread. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh, oh, yeah, that's a Korok seed here, too. Why not? Mm-hmm. A little cup and ball Korok seed. I fucking love all the Korok puzzles. They mm-hmm. are fucking brilliant physical puzzles. You don't have to localize any of these bitches. It's just natural human curiosity that leads you to to solving them, and it's goddamn the most brilliant shit ever. Yep, it's real good. And they're cute little guys. So really, you get two rewards. Yeah, the Koroks are great. I love all their differently shaped leaf faces. Mm-hmm. So also the old man wants you to go up to the top of the tower so you learn how to like mark stuff with your scope, but you also don't need to do that, I'm pretty yeah, sure. Nah. You, you can just go to the shrines. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's funny though, he's not at the uh He's usually here. Is he? In the So like after you do the tower tutorial thing. He shows up here. He sh- yeah, he shows up here. He also shows up at his house, but maybe he's just stuck at the top of the tower. I don't remember him showing up there, but that's me. Yeah, it was... He he would show up there, and it I was... I shouldn't even argue. You knew where the fire and ice <laughs> are. You're, you're almost certainly right. Uh-huh. Uh... Don't, please don't run into me. Um... Whoa. Piggies. <laughs> Yeah, it, it was like the game's way of like introducing you to cooking because you're just like, mm. oh right, he teaches you. Okay. Would love to cook, baby, uh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these those is what made Spider Hyphen Man realize that Tim Platt is just genuinely kind of like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Like what? Perfect? <laughs> perfect person? A king amongst men? What are you implying? <laughs> I forget, when you met some of the Rude Tales people, was Tim there? Oh yeah, Tim was there. Okay. Total sweetie. Everyone on Rude Tales is such a fucking sweetheart. The mm-hmm. only people that weren't there were uh, Branson, because he was in California, and uh, Taylor. Taylor wasn't there. Uh, okay. I'm so lucky I got to have carnitas made by Mr. DeBonesby mm-hmm. and Albie. <laughs> <laughs> it was the best fucking carnitas. Oh my god, like, fuck. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got a fancy cocktail made. It's just, wow. Treated like a princess. Yeah, if you didn't realize Tim Platt's like that with smelly I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> uh, what I should tell you is you gotta watch Come, Come at the King. I, I assume you didn't watch it. <laughs> Fucking smelly man. <laughs> the heel turn? <laughs> that was gonna be the best part of that entire thing. Oh my god. Yeah. Good shit. Last episode, Tonicky watched of oh these those was the normal show which is the one with the 
Oh, everyone good is in that. Groomed is in that one. Oh, hell yeah. His ice form happens in that Oh, one. yeah, ice form. Ice form. Oh, Link's getting into his ice form up here. <laughs> uh, yes, Ryan Nito, for you folks just coming in. Breath of the Wild is running very smoothly. Suspiciously smoothly. Why is that? Uh, I have a super switch. <laughs> I'm emulating it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, the the ship's cat is there. Chestershire is also in that episode, I believe. Damn it! All right, fine. These guys kicked my ass many times. Yeah. But also mostly because I was being too stingy with uh, arrows. Oh yeah. <laughs> I was like trying to use bombs. It was not working. Yeah. It feels the the weirdest thing about emulating this is just that um, this controller doesn't have the uh, the gyro in it. So like I always mm. use that to aim oh, really? a little bit. Yeah, like the fine tuning. Hmm. Oh. I never really, never, never really did that. Mm -hmm. um, do, 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 do. Spears are pretty good to use with with the blue guys because it keeps them at a distance. Yeah. Yeah. Smashing weapon. <laughs> oh! Ho, ho. Oh! Ho, ho. <laughs> yep. I told you not to fuck around with this guy. I know. Use the spear that you just picked up. <laughs> if you use a DS4, you can do gyro stuff. So it's yeah, that makes sense. Syrix. Okay, he dropped his shit. He's nothing now. <laughs> You're nothing to me. He can still hit you with his fists. <laughs> I know, but he's weaker without the sword. I mean, don't fling him off the... Aww, his bits. It doesn't super matter. His bits, it's so early in the game. It's brand new to you. Oh, well. That's just me wishing I was playing Breath of the Wild. <laughs> you have your own Switch. You could always do it. I know. Okay, so we're gonna go somewhere cold, so... That's a bit of a close one. Oh. I forgot how to cook. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need three spicy peppers in here. How do I fucking cook again? Maybe you should have, uh... Talk to the old man who teaches you how to cook. I, well, duh. I need to fucking light, light it. <laughs> duh. Uh. <laughs> there. All right. That's really all I need right now. <laughs> Boop. Oh, hey. There you go. So, into the, the cold. Mm hmm. Not gonna get the, the warm double. I can get it while on the mountain. I thought, I thought you get it from uh, the guy where he's at his shack. You can get it in two different places. Oh, okay. Remember okay. correctly. <laughs> All right, okay. Gee, well, alright. <laughs> Let this little guy go. Yeah, I appreciate that Link's a little guy. Mm. He's like smaller than every other major character in the game, I think. We stand a 5'4 king. I think even Zelda's taller than him in this game. I don't know. I think. Man, I wish I could already have the snowshoes. I don't even remember where you get that. Ugh... Well, you there's... You don't have to know it. <laughs> okay. I would feel better if you didn't <laughs> have such perfect recall of where to get all these things, because I feel inadequate. Okay, I'll stop. Sheesh. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm it's kidding. only my whole gimmick. Oh, your whole gimmick. I'm supposed to know lots about video games. Uh -huh. 
Oh, it's the guy outside Gerudo Town running around trying to impress women. Right. Mm -hmm. Uh, doop. Doop. Oh, I thought that blew up. No, it's only when bombs are thrown in there. Never mind. Blowing up the meat? No, I thought if you f shot a fire arrow oh. into a fire. The whole crew's here. Yep, sure is. Oh, oh the whole crew's here. Jeez. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Jesus! Fuck off. <laughs> I would have died three times. Give me your arrow. Oh, you whiffed uh, it. <laughs> dumb skeleton. Oh, I'm full. Whatever. I can't eat another spear. I have so many torches. Holy shit. <laughs> A big meat. The big boy. There's no cows in this game, is there? Cattle? No. Where did they get that big meat? I guess it's a pig. Yeah. Huh? I mean, if you look at the, the size of the, the pigs in this game, did cows, just... did cows go extinct after Ocarina of Time? Where is this on the timeline? I refuse to actually care about that, but is this post <laughs> the extinction of cows? Mm. I guess so. Cows aren't real. Think about it. Have you ever seen one in person? Saw them on the highway. It was that like... a cow or was that a horse we saw? <laughs> that one time. The, that truck that was carrying some livestock. Those, were cows. Those were cows in Those there, cows, right? Yeah. I forgot if it was a horse truck or a cow truck. <laughs> There are cows in Breath of the Wild? What? Oh, yeah! Oh, my God, these hunky bo boys. There are cows in this game, I forgot. Those hunka chunkers. They're in Hateno Village. Mm -hmm. it's like the, I think it's like the only place. And you cannot kill it, it's domesticated. Mm. So it doesn't even count. <laughs> it's a pet. If an animal cannot be killed, it is a pet. Mm -hmm. We figured it out. <laughs> Hey. Hey. I made this explicitly so that you could not see me. These guys are so cool. Yeah. You can't pet any animals in this game, Electric Remus. Nope. I would not be very surprised if they, they added, it. added that to Tears of the Kingdom. Very yeah. high demand. Japan had no idea how much America would bitch and moan about not being able to pet that dog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a com you're missing a whole marketing beat on Twitter, you guys. Mm -hmm. That's why you can pet a dog in every game now. Yeah, it's literally that one Twitter account just made <laughs> every game developer crunch a little harder <laughs> to get petting dogs and cats and things. Now it's too. It's it's. This game came out years before. Can you pet the dog? Get out of hat here. Get out of town. Mm. Um. Isn't it crazy that this eh. this game came out like? I believe you. Six years ago. Well, my point my point still stand. I didn't say this came out before that account. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying that that account has been the bane of many developers now because mm -hmm. people want the dogs to be pet. Um. Just in case my mm -hmm. stay warm heat resistance potion or uh, cold resistance potion goes out. Snowball. Uh oh. Snowballs. <laughs> Wild snowball. Oh, fuck off. I can't sprint while I'm holding the torch. I'll put it away. Uh, frosty skeletons. You know, I have fire arrows. I could just light something on fire mm -hmm. and then light my torch on that. Yeah. Might be better to just sprint. Mm-hmm. I should have made a stamina potion, too, but oh well. Leave me alone. 
I have to get to Ganon. Oh, I have no idea how much damage those guys do if they touch you. Well, they certainly will freeze me on contact. That's a lot of cute skeleton, skeleton uh, emojis you got there. Insane intentions, yo. Wow. Are you in my Discord? We just made a hot skeletons channel. <laughs> and by we, I mean me! Haha. <laughs> <laughs> I got high on 420, and I was like, I want to see some cool skeletons. Did you get some cool skeletons? I got so many cool skeletons. Oh, yeah. That's the good Inclu shit. Including the guy from uh, Return of the Living Dead, the the, the tar guy. Mm-hmm. Oh, he counts. He's a cool skeleton. I should just go get the doublet. Yeah, the doublet. The doublet. I don't know how, <laughs> I don't know how you say it. If you want to slide into that Discord, it is a Patreon-only perk. Sorry to say, I don't just I don't just give out the invites so willy-nilly. You gotta earn it with me. Whoa. Ooh. Whoa. Oh, the boy is cold and falling. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be cold for much longer. <laughs> Double. Thanks for subbing. Give me a shirt. I'm dying. <laughs> Thanks for subbing, Diane the Pug. Double. <laughs> Did you know about the scope? You kind of avoided the whole scope tutorial. Shut up, Mr. I'm chilly. Thank you. Yes, I'm chilly, sir. No. Oh. The baby is cold. Look so at him. So cute. Such a cute animation. I just love our boy. This is one of my favorite links, I think. Yeah, definitely. I really like his like mullety hairstyle. It really grew on me. The, my, my favorite link designs are probably this uh, Wind, Wind Waker, Waker yeah. of course. Uh -huh. And then um, Link Link's Awakening. Oh. The the little tiny figure of Link I got in the back there. Mm -hmm. That's that's Link's Awakening. Cutie pie. Because that one's like kind of lanky and he's got the really long bangs, kind of swooshing out straight out sideways from his hat. Mm. Where where in your heart lies pink haired Link? I like pink haired Link. That's probably number four. There should be a uh, alternate skin in Breath of the Wild 2. I agree. In Tears of the Kingdom, that's just pink hair Link. Or the ability to dye your hair. Oh, dyeing like, your hair. Just like your clothes. Yeah. Oh, man. Um, make Link a blue SJW. Come on, do it. <laughs> make a man. No, make no. A, make make right wing YouTube pee their pants so No, hard. Link is woke now. No. Oh, my diaper's filling up so fast. I'm so <laughs> mad. <laughs> <laughs> Buy my new conservative dipes for men that know that they're men and know a bathroom to go into. Finally. To poop their pants in. Tactical dipes. Tactical dipers. Deploying the dipe. <laughs> Deploying the package. <laughs> Doo doo in the dipe. That's the package. That's America. <laughs> By the way, buy my brain pills. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for subbing, Marabriel? Mabariel. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. When will they give Link a gun? <laughs> uh, I was looking at mods for the emulated version because there's a pretty big Ooh. mod scene for this. Uh, and there is a Give Link a Gun mod that is called <laughs> Give Link a Gun. How does it function? I don't, I, I don't know. I just saw a screenshot of Link with like a, a handgun in his hand <laughs> and like explosions happening Jeez, around him. that's dumb. Uh, but no, some, there's some other really big notable mods for the emulated version. Um, there's a really high effort mod that replaces Link with Zelda. Mm -hmm. to have playable Zelda. They replace all of Link's voices with like new voice acting, like fan voice acting wow, what? for Zelda. They were... They changed all the text so that people refer to you as Zelda. Whoa. Um, and also every single equipable outfit in the game, they made a new variation for Zelda. Get out. Oh my God, that's high effort. Yeah. Oh, right. It's going to recharge. Yeah, you gotta it has recharge. to recharge. <laughs> Don't die, little man. Yep. I think this shrine is the first time I died when I played this the first time. 
Yeah. Because I got squished right here. I got, I, I got squished because I didn't know I had to recharge. Yeah. I got cocky and died. Oh, I should have frozen it. I was going down. You don't have to. I just want to get the chest. Yeah, but I don't think you have to freeze it to make it up there, but I understand mm. why you would want to. Whoop. Bye-bye. Oh, I was going <laughs> to say, honey, be careful. <laughs> no, I was trying to freeze the ball was still down yeah, there, but it just... They're out of range. Oh, I should have. Eh. <laughs> Oh, I'm full. Yeah. I can't eat another bite. You should get rid of the the thing that's about to break. I'm going to throw it to do extra damage. Okay, fine. <laughs> Why do I know? <laughs> it kills the garbage. <laughs> oh, <guy>. shit. <laughs> now he can never get off the plateau. <laughs> kills the mummified guy. Um, yeah, there's some other, like, really giant mods that add, like, more survival mechanics, so hunger system and that type of shit. Oh, um, wow. Hmm. Hard four. There's a really big one that adds a bunch of, like, new extra weapons, as well as a new town and new side quests. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. I think that one's, like, still being worked on, but Damn. it's, like, playable. Um, Ambitious. Yeah. There's some absurdly high effort shit uh, mod wise for this game. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's Linkle mods. Oh, yes, they were talking about that in the chat. Mm -hmm. Linkle. A multiplayer mod? Yes, yes. Whoa. That got shut down by Nintendo like earlier this week. That, yeah. <laughs> People are so talented. Mm hmm. It's incredible. I almost killed myself there. Shit, dude. <laughs> I saw that in slow motion. I I killed myself on some of these cliffs because I was getting impatient and like letting go to grab again and letting go to grab again and like just barely missing a little grab point. Yeah. I love that he skids when he grabs again. It's so nice. Do, 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 do. This game is so chill. Mm -hmm. Except when it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Except when shit goes real bad. I mean, that's the beautiful push and pull of this game, right? Mm hmm. I need so many spicy peppers for this. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, the rain is the worst, Weg. Mm hmm. Just no climbing allowed. That's why, uh, if you want to avoid or mitigate the rain, one of the best things you can do early on in the game is try to get Rivali's Gale. Mm, yeah. So that you can just do big jumps. Big jumps. Are there squirrels in this game? Yeah. Yeah, right? Mm hmm Do you get little meats if you... If you shoot them, or do they turn to... I think... They turn to a nut, don't they? I think they just drop an acorn, yeah. Yeah, they turn to a nut. They're, they're, <laughs> there's no meat on them bones. <laughs> they are made of nut. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, for people who haven't played this, if you come here, this is the other way to get this the shirt that makes you warm. The doublé. Uh, the doublé. <laughs> this is the little shack where the old man lives. Uh, this is a place where it, he also teaches you to cook, because there's mm -hmm. like... It's like, hmm, I'll give you this shirt if you cook me something. And it's a specific thing. Yeah, so you have to go get, like, a, tra a highly bad something. It He's got, like, a diary you can read. Yeah, the diary teaches you what he likes. Yeah. And uh, it also serves as a tutorial for, like, hey, food has effects. Yep. You can stay warm if you eat the spicy food. Mm-hmm. Some people here have never seen him in his shed. 
Or I've never been over here. That's crazy. Oh, wow. That's crazy. Oh, this area is also... Uh, it's also where you learn, like, oh, I can use... I can chop down trees to traverse Yeah, maps. because depending what time of day it is, nighttime, I think he's just chilling out by the fire. Mm -hmm. Daytime, yeah, he's working chopping a little bit. Wood. Yeah, chopping wood. Um, and there just happens to be another axe by a tree. Mm-hmm. Pink Next hits. to a big gap that leads you directly to a shrine. Wink, wink. Wink. Spicy Minton asking, should I make myself a fourth cup of coffee? That sounds like a lot. Mm. <laughs> Depends what time it is where you're at. What's your tolerance to caffeine and coffee, I guess? Mm. Me and Chip were talking about this, like, yesterday. Like, oh, should I have a second very weak energy drink <laughs> and then yeah. i was like fucking sure there's people that drink like coffee all fucking day and yep. they're fine like we're not we have no risk of like getting all fucked up from that there's that chest oh uh -oh. i got a little too close uh -oh. now he mad i have to allow the term fisting <laughs> Because <laughs> someone said there's people at my work double fisting energy drinks in the morning. <laughs> well, two lasers. I oh. just want my Nintendo Switch shirt. Uh oh. You remember that too? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I love the Nintendo Switch. Mm -hmm. Jabaj. Yeah, I'm very excited for Tears of the Kingdom to come out because it lines up very perfectly with uh, a plane ride. A big old plane ride. Very long plane ride. Big old long old plane ride. To Japan. Fuck yeah. 14-hour plane ride on the release date of this game. I could not have it's planned gonna, that more it's perfect by accident. so fucking god. That's ah. so good. 14 hours where it's I can do nothing but play Tears of the Kingdom. I'm so fucking lucky. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. Shout out to Horizon Forbidden West for releasing another thing around the time of Zelda. <laughs> yeah. They just can't get away from Japanese developed open world games that are better than the other game. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm well, sorry for saying that. Less ugly. Somebody uh, posted like a screen cap in my Discord because they were playing the DLC or for, you know, this Horizon thing or something. And they were like, yeah. Yeesh! Yeah. <laughs> it's bright up in here. Fuck. Oh. I keep forgetting. <laughs> you're full. That I'm full. I got so full. much shit on me. <laughs> you look so cute with that t shirt on. <laughs> He's just a guy. Just one of the lads. Oh my god, is there a mod that is just like make Link look like a middle school dude in the mid 2000s where it's that one fucking green Zelda shirt with oh the god. yellow Triforce and he's wearing like khaki cargo shorts? Khaki cargo shorts. <laughs> like that fucking look that every dude had for oh. a decade. Congoer Link, yeah. <laughs> what Link? Congoer. Oh yeah. <laughs> Diane saying, Chip, I got bad news for you. That's not a dude anymore. <laughs> <laughs> We're almost done with the Great Plateau. Mm -hmm. Didn't take that long. It only took uh, an hour. <laughs> I wanted to stream tonight. I wasn't going to do an advanced save at All the end of the, right, right. the plateau. That's fair. Oh, that's the big one. <laughs> <laughs> that, I uh, put the bomb in that here. That's go there. Go in! <laughs> <laughs> go in! Oh no, you need more. 
No, I don't. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> she just put another bomb oh, down. I'm tired, honey. Honey. I'm sleepy. He just wants to see me fuck up. No, I do not. <laughs> I don't. I just no? want to get to the exciting part. Okay. I know what the Great Plateau looks like. I don't know what it looks like to go straight to Ganon mm -hmm. and get obliterated and then do fun roulette stuff. That's what I'm joking yeah, for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm sleepy. I got up You're at like sleepy. 9.30 in the oh, morning no. to record a podcast. Yeah. A podcast. Mm-hmm. And I got another podcast tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Grandpa. Nice shirt, Link. <laughs> It was not about the Mario movie. That should have come out I this thought... week. Yeah, is that out maybe publicly? It comes out, maybe it comes out Monday publicly. Mm -hmm. Actually. Hello, today's podcast was another Retronauts thing. Mm -hmm. Having a lot of fun collabs with the Retronauts crew recently. Very yeah, nice. they seem very cool. Very nice people. Oh, he got tired. I fucked up. <laughs> Ugh, okay. And tomorrow it's uh, D and D time, baby. Leveling up. Mm. My baby's first level up. Nice. Hype. Uh, sun Sunday, <laughs> the day the day of worship for D and D players. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the most common day to do D and D, perhaps. I just realized. I think they never make it rain until you get off the Great Plateau. Yeah, you know. Wait. Hmm. Does it rain on the Great Plateau if you go back later? I'm pretty sure. I don't know. Let's see, I'm not going for extra health. I'm going for extra stamina. Mm, that makes sense. For running away. <laughs> running the fuck away. <laughs> yeah, the D and D movie was fucking good. I have not. Yeah, been that on... movie was shockingly good. I have not been on a podcast about the good thing I saw. <laughs> and it's not even like, oh, that's good for a D and D movie. It was just like, oh, I'm watching like a capital M movie, like has, how they used to feel back has, in the day. It has setups and payoffs and plot hooks and characters that yeah. grow and change. Wh huh? And instead of having a scary evil laser shoot up into the sky, scary evil things come down, down from, from the, the sky. sky bitch. Yeah. <laughs> It was actually funny too. I was very surprised. I'm not used to. I'm not used to like movies being funny anymore because like when they try yeah. to be funny, it's like this really quippy, insufferable, like lampshady yeah. way of doing it. And it's like, man, that's not actually humorous. <laughs> mm -hmm. They fly now. Yeah. The. Yeah, I'm thinking they fly now. The reason why it all works is because it's a movie where the script writers didn't think the premise they were writing for was stupid, and so everyone in the in the story has to go, "Oh, this is dumb." Uh, stupid, huh? Well done, there, young one. Do you want high, me to skip the cutscene? High fantasy, so dumb, just like this in the Nintendo right. Switch shirt. <laughs> I was King Rome boss for And yeah, I really enjoy that. Um, I was uh, the last leader of Hyrule. The D&D movie was not, like, set in such a way where it was, like, normal people are rolling dice, and they imagine God. a beautiful, yeah. wondrous world. Like, no, it just takes place in the fucking world. We, Fuck you. Yeah, no dice. Go away. Don't always need a frame story like <laughs> that, don't please. don't need to frame it like that. The great calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path. Love. <laughs> a century ago. I this love his. Does, this guy does not sound British except for a couple words. Yeah. Poth. And since that I love his giant Triforce belt buckle. <laughs> I did not think it wise to overwhelm you while your memory was still fragile. I know you're dumb. So rather than that, <laughs> I don't want to break your brain. My little himbo of, of destiny. <laughs> <laughs> Forgive me. I never taught you to read. <laughs> Ready to hear what happened. Your cell sword to me. Years ago. 
to know Calamity Ganon's truth. God, Muppets D and D movie. One Fucking imagine. Oh yeah. <gasps> imagine. The was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. Oh, Muppet D and D monsters. Oh my God. Mm. I would love more physical prop monsters in movies. The I mean, they had it in the D&D movie. I was they did. I was shook. I, you know, Jarnathan. Mm. What a hunky Eric Croker. I could not believe he was real. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, he looked great. The whole time when they were like, oh, I hear Jarnathan is, is going to be at this thing. He's an Eric Croker. I was just like, oh, oh, uh -huh. big bird man. <laughs> big bird man. Big bird man. And like the first like 10 minutes of the movie, I was just like, oh, when's the bird man going to be here? Yeah. I love bird guys. They're so cool. These relics. The divine beasts were giant machines piloting. Yeah, and Jarnathan does have a very like DM making up a name the last second energy. And that's one of the reasons I love Jarnathan. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, all practical effects, this fucking awesome, right? Ancient legends, oft repeated. I've been getting like TikTok posts about the puppets and the the costumes and yeah. how Jarnathan moves, and it's like, whoa, we TikTok, you were right. I did want to know more about Jarnathan. <laughs> Chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power. Why is Link red in this? Hmm? Link's when red in that. That's weird. Yeah. Power, and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear <clears throat> we must follow our ancestors. Um. I was going to say something else about the D&D &D movie. Jarnathan. Jarnathan's fun. Jarnathan. <laughs> I like a good Jarnathan. Oh, there's a Jarnathan on the left. Yeah. We dub these pilots champions. He's a dick. He's a dick. But he's cool. Oh, I was imagining a Muppet mimic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Cute. Imagine that. Cute. Fredo was talking to... But... They had seen the D&D &D movie and did not realize, somehow, that during, like, the big, like, arena part, like, where it has a, a bunch of different monsters show up, like, they yeah. didn't know that those were from D&D, &D, and it's like, of course they... <laughs> what? Like, of course they were. Mm -hmm. You've never heard of a gelatinous cube? Like, you don't have to be into D&D &D to have heard of a mimic or gelatinous cube. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Muppet D and D would be similar to Labyrinth, but I yeah. think the prota there would be mm, more puppet, more puppets in the party. Yeah. And thus, the kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely. Muppet D and D should be like several other Muppet movies where there's a single human actor and he's like a they're like a really highly respected actor yeah like if it was labyrinth david bowie would be the the human and not jennifer connelly yeah yeah you are a fine would kermit be a paladin the question posited by the chat uh there is a mobile game a disney mobile game where you're like you're fighting. It's like a gotcha game, and all the Disney characters are like guys you recruit to fight, and they all have like new designs to be like combat oriented. And Kermit is in there, and he's a bard. I could see Kermit as a bard, yeah, because I mean, like he's the the one that's always you know got the banjo and very iconic yep. singing stuff like that. Would Animal be a bard, or would he be a barbarian or something? Would who be a what? Animal. Oh. Because you got you got all the the whole electric mayhem. Dr. Teeth and Electric Mayhem staff, to contend with, and it's like, well, obviously they're all bards, but I don't know if they'd be in the party though. They'd be like, yeah, they'd be in a town, in a pub, mm. playing in a pub. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, Miss Piggy would be a barbarian, maybe. Yeah. What's Gonzo? She calls out for sorcerer. Yeah. Hundred <laughs> percent sorcerer. <laughs> yeah. Once that happens. Will is there some type of or a very funny rogue that is very clumsy is there some type of class that deal is is there like a beast master or anything like that uh, druids i guess a little bit so just want to associate a class with a chicken somehow <laughs> you know well the chicken can be his, his familiar oh yeah you can always have a familiar yeah oh ranger rangers have animal companions yeah mm -hmm. that's true somehow Ganon has maintained control over all four divine beasts, 
as well as those guardians swarming around. Beastmaster is a castle. subclass of ranger. Hmm. Hmm. I was just trying to think what class Fozzie was. Yeah. Directly to the castle at this point. It'd be funny if he was a wizard because you have to have high like intelligence to be a wizard, and he is the opposite. So. <laughs> yeah. Follow the road after and he also has low charisma, so sorcerer would also be there funny. You will mm -hmm. find the elder Impa. She will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Consult the map on your Shiga slate for the precise location Shiga. of Mariko Village. <laughs> Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, huh? follow the road as it proceeds. What? North. What class would the Swedish chef be? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Again, I just keep thinking like the, the weirder and clumsier the Muppet is, the more I want to see them be a rogue, even though that's mm. not a class they do well at, just for comedy's sake. <laughs> Oscar the Grouch is not a Muppet, he's a Sesame Street man. We're talking about the Muppets. Mm -hmm. He's a Muppet, we're talking about the, Muff <laughs> the Muppets. All right, destroy again and get to it, kiddo. Okay, here I go. <laughs> Get over there. Let me let me just do just one. Fall off the tower, die immediately. <laughs> we just do one more thing here. Oh yeah, you got a little Korok up there or something. I believe so. Yeah. I once uh, drew the cast of Rue Tales of Magic in Muppet style. It was oh yeah. Pretty cute. Uh, Cordelia, the Sasquatch, who is. Very big, very tall, was uh, a Sweetums type Muppet, <laughs> where it's like a person in a big costume. Yeah. Oh, Swedish chef as an artif artificer. There you mm. go. Mm. Here we go. Come here, Gannon, you bitch. Any second. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Princess said go, I'm going. Hold on. Be right there. Be right there. Well, I should probably get a horse. Yeah, up to you. I think there's horses like semi nearby. Somewhere right outside the Great Plateau. Yeah. Well the stable's very close to on the left side, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's a Korok. Oh yeah. Yeah. No, we're not using any speedrun strats. Nope. Just going. Just getting the normal lead out. Korok was very lucky that that rock did not fall on his skull. I always drop them on his skull. I hate doing it. They're I, little friends, and why would I want to drop a rock on their head? I always drop a rock on their head, and it's because they make a little cute noise. They go, eh. They do, but it's in pain. <laughs> they got a hard head. They're fine. Bonies. You motherfucker! I scared the horse. <laughs> it's like he bit you in midair. <laughs> I got horse bit. Horse bit. Fucking calm down. Soothe, 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 soothe. <laughs> there. <laughs> oh. oh man. Chill out. Oh, I hate what's happened to me. <laughs> uh, Chill out. The very lovely piano ditty mm -hmm. that play when you on horse. This one's really cranky. Man, he ain't, he ain't liking this. Gotta break him in. Dizzy bum saying, excuse me, we're going where? <laughs> no, 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 no. Well, I should help these people because they'll give me food. Mm. Damn, here comes a hero. <laughs> I got tired from doing that. Here I come. I just, hold up for me. Hey. 
Yeah, yo. Bop. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Pincer attack, both of them. <laughs> Oh, they got you. Bring out the roulette. Yep. So here's the, the main... <laughs> Didn't even get close. Yes. So here's the big thing we got. I got a big-ass wheel. I think there's 50 things on here. I just died trying to get to Ganon. So what do I have to do now? Let's find out. <laughs> Too bad we don't have any sound effects for this. What are we gonna get? <gasps> They're weighted differently. Upgrade weapon slots. Hey, okay. All right, that's good. You need that anyway. That's a good one. So yeah, no Ganon yet. We gotta upgrade a weapon slot just once. <laughs> that's a that's a beneficial one. Yeah. And you can help these guys out again. Mm-hmm. <laughs> More carefully this time. <laughs> More carefully. <laughs> Yeah, we gotta book it all the way to the forest. Gotta get some some bits. Well, actually, you gotta. You know, Hestu's not at the forest yet. He's near Kakariko. Yeah, you gotta find him in Kakariko. Yeah. Mm, there you go. Yeah, yeah. Distracted. Better. Oh. Uh. Let's drop this. Now, if we die before completing it, I believe we'll. It's just you still have to complete it. Yep. Yeah. You know, the tasks don't stack with each death. Ooh. Oh shit. I don't even have that many hearts yet, bud. Shit. Thanks. Better than food. Oh yeah, we got three billion extra side quests I will activate now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> DLC. I like how this horse is like, well, I guess I'll wait for that guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so. Gotta find Hestu. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Should have, uh, added a, uh... Yeah. A beacon. A, a scene for your OBS that's, like, current task. Oh, shit, Don't you're it. right. It crossed out, and it'd be like, uh, do this, do, do the task. I could do that real quick. If you want to just if you want to, if you, talk if you, with if the you chat. Think of vibes, sure. Yeah. I'll talk to the chat. Ask me anything, chatterinos. Yeah, I don't know if uh, Chip intends to do any shrines on the way to these things, but uh, he might activate the shrines for waypoints. For teleportation points. How am I? I'm cool. I'm still riding high off that little sandwich from earlier. Very good. Very satisfied with that. Good ass sandwich. My coffee shop order is hot cocoa because I do not drink coffee. <laughs> it's too bitter. I'm a baby. I don't like any coffee. And my D&D character is a secret. You'll meet them one day. Why can I not type? Right now. <laughs> like, it won't let me type. Class, race, neuroses, they're all a secret. I go to start typing in current task. When I hit C, it makes Cortana appear instead. Cortana, get out of here. That's a Cortana. It's a MacBook. I'm remoting into my stream PC, Ooh, which is Windows. I'm stupid. Ooh. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. Um, uh, alignment? We don't do alignments. <laughs> alignments are dumb. Just, just act cool. Just. <laughs> also, like, if your alignment is evil, your chance of becoming, like, a murder hobo just skyrockets exponentially in the first place. <laughs> it was upgrade weapon slots, right? Mm-hmm. Upgrade a weapon slot. Alignment is something for the DM to track, but I think you could just, like, count on your DM to be like, that was really in character for what you've previously established without being like, that was cool and and neutral evil of you. Here's an inspiration die. Like, you know, you could just give out inspiration dice for, for whatever, man. 
yeah. Playing playing role playing games where you just go around murdering people is not actually fun to do. Not there fun for anybody else either. We've got our task. Task up. Oh, I don't want to leave my horse behind. What am I doing? Mm -hmm. What do you name him? Buppy? <laughs> yeah, Buppy13. That's his name. Aya Bray Bray. Now that you're on the horse, your uh, thing that you wrote is blocking some prompts of, that are associated with horse. Uh, FYI. Okay. We'll put it up at the top instead, maybe. Would have been very funny if I killed myself with that chest. That, oh god. Hey, my. F <laughs> Put out a hit for yourself Rupees. for a purple, a purple ruby. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just gonna lie and wait for this guy. Mm -hmm. No need to chase it. Let it come to you. I hear you jingling. Jig is up. You're jingling. What? Oh, oh, oh. That was close, that was close. <laughs> the jingle's up. Okay, let me... And that's what they sound like when you drop a rock on them. <laughs> I don't want to put it on top because it'll block notifications and shit. Oh, you're right. Ooh, hearty, I want those. Hearty radishes. Very important. Absolutely need this shit. <laughs> oh. Also. Meat. Meat. Beedly boodly boop. Weggy got the fan art. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 oh man, look at me. <laughs> oh, the things on the wheel are buy five Funko Pops, uh -huh. uh, Neil Breen Marathon, uh, something uh, for every game, which is being blocked by Ganon's big old hand, mm -hmm. uh, set your house on fire, 100% uh, <laughs> Gex 2, <laughs> subscribe to Twitter Blue. <laughs> nice. Divorce. <laughs> <laughs> And bake cookies without a recipe. <laughs> <laughs> Some of these are significantly harder than others. I under. <laughs> it's really good though. <laughs> Him in the little outfit. Oh my god, I'm so cute. Thank you, Weggy. <laughs> Subscribe to Titter Blue. Oh. oh, the big meat. Damn it. Ah. Whoop! Whoop! Oh, you did get him, but they're really sturdy. Oh shit! You got him. Yep. Oh my god, Jesus Christ! There's my air I whiffed. Okay. <laughs> Shot him right in the meat. Yeah. Whoa, shit! I have to allow the term in the butt. <laughs> Uh, two raw meats. Whoa. Octorok has got a number. Ah. My horse! <laughs> Son Whoa. of a bitch! He's. Coward! <laughs> he got spooked! Coward, get back here. I wish real life had the cartoon meat with the bone sticking out of it. Mm -hmm. There was a place in Japan that made those. Um, I don't know what it is, though, but it showed up on a, a episode of Game Center CX. I think he was playing Bonk's, oh, yeah. Bonk's Adventure, which features those big, beautiful anime meats on bones. Yeah. No, Octoroks are not edible in this. They uh, drop balloons. Yep. Which you can use for uh, really absurd ways to get nice B-roll footage of the environment. Yeah. That was an interesting uh, rabbit hole. 
It's a lot of keys around. Wow. Damn. Yeah, Jesus. I feel like I've never seen this many like three swarms in a yeah, row. Yeah, three swarms. Whoa. Whoa! My horse didn't like that. Okay, so I'm not gonna do this shrine right now, but I am gonna activate it so I can fast travel. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Fuck off. Ah, oh, damn it. Ooh, multiples. You chump. Oh, yes, and they also drop parts you can use in elixirs. That is true. Yep. Okay. Got some fast travel going on. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Give me that. can't uh, jump and throw sorry no. i don't think you can do that yep <laughs> you know what let's put it away just smack it <laughs> i don't want to uh fine <laughs> there <laughs> i don't want to use the bombs to save durability and the thing Is that's so hard <laughs> yes oh, my God. horse <laughs> he's really fucking off <laughs> oh grasshoppers <laughs> yeah Oh, too bad there's guys everywhere. What are you doing? You're my horse. Ah, <laughs> uh, my wedding vows. <laughs> what are you doing? You're my horse. You're my horse. <laughs> Come on, chill out. You're doing good. You're doing great. You're a horse. Keep up the good work. You're locomoting. <laughs> I want to die. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, this guy in the bridge here, if you stand on top of the side of the bridge here and then talk to him, he tries to convince you from uh, uh, to not jump off the bridge. Yeah, he thinks you're uh, going to kill yourself. Yep. Dark joke. How you doing, chat? No, oh, chill out. How many more times do I have to give you affection? Until you function like a normal horse. <laughs> also my wedding vows. Ah! <laughs> Fine, there's a Korok here. No amount of affection will fix my, my bad horse tendencies. <laughs> Looks like Robin Williams. It wasn't on purpose, though. Yeah. I do not think. <laughs> a very willful horse you found yourself. So on. willful. He needs a. A very Cut this willful, shit out. A willful and naughty horse. <laughs> Run over that the guy. Run him over. Run him over. No mercy. <laughs> yeah. Meat. <laughs> we hunted in style. Drive bys. <laughs> Ramming speed. Uh, I don't think horses drop meat when they die. No, I'm pretty sure they don't. Again, they're pets. Yeah. 
No, pets can't die. Oh, wait, pets can't die. <laughs> but horses can die in this Meats. game. Mm. Mm. Animals that can attack you. No. You can get meat from bears too. Shit like that. Mm -hmm. Never mind. No. There's there's no uh there's no easy way around it. <laughs> <laughs> Things aren't so black and white after all. No, it's true, not in this crazy mixed up world. Okay, I gotta register this horse. Gotta get my horse license. You gotta name this guy so he stops being so willful. I gotta rotate my horse's uh, hooves. <laughs> Change his fluids. What's his name? Willful? <laughs> willful Pete. Willful Will. This is my horse now. I can give you directions! <laughs> <laughs> I love to do that! You. Horse puppy. Huppy. Huppy. <laughs> Hi. All right. What are we naming the horse? Hank the Chorse. Uh, <laughs> no. Um. Uh, people are saying Huppy and Buppy. Drive by. <laughs> Drive by. Drive by yeah. His name's Drive by. I like that one a lot. <laughs> That's a good one. It looks like his name is Driviby. Uh. <laughs> Should I make it Drive Space by? Drivby. Dri Drivby. No, Drivby. fuck it. It's Drivby. You willful boy, Drivby. <laughs> <laughs> there, Drivby the horse. Drivby. They all ate at the same time. I sure did. Triplets. <laughs> this is not a drive-by. <laughs> it's a horse. Beetle. Yeah. Beetle. He's kind of he's kind of fit in this one. Isn't he, he is. I mean, he's got a big fucking backpack. He's got to carry. He's so. Fit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Has anyone cosplayed like the full ca caboodle here with Beetle? Hmm. <laughs> Cause like it would be very cumbersome. Wow, I've got exactly enough rupees to buy some extra arrows. Hey. Oh. What? I don't. Oh, I said I, I'll take them all. Oh. That's. Oh. That was the problem wow. there. Wow. Not to full scale, but Bat Bro TV did oh. cosplay as Beetle. Hmm. That's wonderful. I, I I do. I am interested to see. Accurate full scale backpack beetle. Yeah. I mean, you, it could happen. You can make it out of styrofoam and just wow. like, you know, glue fabric to it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wait, he had a bunch more arrows I could just buy single. Individual singles. arrows. Wow. Wow. <laughs> a full cosplay of Wind Waker Beetle where you drive the boat. <laughs> <laughs> there is that one cosplayer that makes those really large props, like the the Guardian from Breath of the Wild. Oh, yeah. And uh, the Cat Bus from Spirited Away? Mm -hmm. No, not Spirited Away. My neighbor Totoro. How do I get out of this one? Ha, da ha, ma. <laughs> I, I forget if the spikes retract. Tele teleport. <laughs> It would have been funny if I touched those spikes and died. <laughs> oh, they despawn when you go inside, apparently. Oh, okay. I'll just go inside and leave. <laughs> Thanks, Wags. Wow, cool. Bye. Bye. <laughs> No, they do not. I'll just, uh, <laughs> I guess I gotta do the shrine. I'll, just, um, I'll do the shrine. I guess you gotta beat the shrine. <laughs> can can you explode them? No, because then you... I don't think you can explode those spikes. Should I check if I can explode the spikes or just do the thing? Just do the thing. Just do the thing. Yeah, I'm not sure if they will catch on fire because they are in water. Yeah. Oh, dang. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
don't need another ring to make that jump. I'm scared. <laughs> You'll just land on the ice cube again. <laughs> it's true. Oh yeah, this thing. Mm hmm this is a cute shrine. I like this shrine a lot. It's fun. Sorry, I'm yawning so much. I know, you're sleepy. I miss a sleepy beepy. Mm hmm Whoop, whoop. Oh, oh, so close. I'm surprised it, uh... I know. You got, ah, it uh, did. Surprised you got a decent angle on that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that would have been funny if I stopped it the other way. Whoa. Go in. I beat you. My horse! <laughs> <laughs> there we go. The missile is eepy. <laughs> the missile is eepy. Yep. <laughs> I'm referencing a TikTok I saw that's total fucking nonsense. I loved it. Yeah. Mm hmm What time is it? It's 10.36. Okay. Come to me, my horse! Drivby! Drivby! That's a good Drivby. Less willful now that I've named thee. <laughs> With a name comes subservience. <laughs> Well, he's still not quite there. He still kind of wants to go on his his own way sometimes. Still willful as always, Drivby. <laughs> Where's this Ganon guy? <laughs> That's right, you're going to the other thing. Yep. Gotta find Hestu, which I oh, yeah, believe he's up is... here, yeah. Yeah. Yep, yep. Gotta get his maracas back. Oh, get these orbs. This will be good for extra hearts later. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. I just really wanted that one thing. Uh -huh. Thank you. <laughs> oh, there's another one. Damn it, Drift B! Drift B! the shit out of that guy. Fucking yikes! There he is. Hello. Is it just me or do you see him as having like a goatee? No, I see that. I always saw him as having a goatee with that leaf. Mm hmm Shalaka! <laughs> Ogre Battle saying Hestu should be played by John Goodman in the movie. <laughs> yeah. Or Guillermo del Toro. I get, I get del Toro vibes from Hestu. <laughs> Kicked it into a wall, he friggin' dope. I love just like chumping idiots with with bombs over and over again. It, they're so doofus. Mm hmm. Hey. Hi. Hi. Oh, hey.
This guy doesn't even know, doesn't even know anything's going on. <laughs> hey, a bee just stung me. What the... Okay, fine. Bam! Yeah. Oh yeah, got one off the cliff. Oh. Spanked. All right. My DM said they were gonna give me some questions about leveling up. There's mm. no questions. Damn. Ha! Huh. I desire questions. <laughs> Been shaking him since he was two years old. No. Oh, he's been annoying for 98 years. <laughs> or however old he is. I don't know. He's now two and a half, says Hamlin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's not old, he's just big. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Shalaka. Oh yeah, he was around an age of calamity, so he's at least a hundred and two. Yep, that's true. Okay, upgrading the weapon slots. Shaky Shaka. Never skip this. Nope. Okay, so the question is, am I done with the task or can I upgrade? I, I think you're done with the task. Just upgrading the slots once. That's what I had in mind yeah. too, but I just wanted to make sure other people didn't think that was dumb or yeah. something. I think part of the challenge is that you can't do it unless you get it on the on the roulette wheel. Yep. All right. Done uh, with task, current task, kill Ganon. Yep. <laughs> Back to Ganon. There we go. All right. Trying to think the quickest way from here. Do they call him Ganon in French? Hmm. Ganon. <laughs> I don't know. Gun all home. You're right. <laughs> what is a Ganon run? Is this speed run practice? For those of you who just came in, eh, it's just a silly thing. Yeah. I'm just seeing the... Uh, just a different way to play it that we invented. I don't know, maybe someone else has done this before, but not to our knowledge. Uh, but it's just a... Uh, go kill Ganon ASAP. Yep. Get over... Get your ass over there. Try to kill that Ganon. And if you bone it up, we hit the roulette wheel, and we have to do a task on the roulette wheel. I say we. I'm not playing. Chip is playing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Man, those roosters, they're beautiful. Yeah. Okay. There's the castle. <laughs> I believe I should be able to glide to another horse stable from here. Yes, this is attempt two. We yep. died on the way to... The castle by two two blue um I forget what they're called. Moblins? Bacoblins? Bacoblins, right. What how why did I mistake uh, how did I forget the word bacoblins? I'm sleepy! Yep. Two blue bacoblins, uh pincer attacked. 
<laughs> and spanked our little three-hearted boy. Could have sworn there is a horse stable around this area. Mm. Could be being blocked by the, like, the mountains and shit. I don't know. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> Seer of time, I... I went into the castle through the back door. <laughs> <laughs> there was like a little, uh, little emergency exit port where boats could leave from, and I snuck in through there. Oh, yeah. There's also a little jail area you can sneak in through. I've, ne I've never gone through the front door. <laughs> Oh man, there's Lizzle foes there. Mm -hmm. Damn. This roulette gets activated when we die. Again, I don't mean to steal valor by saying we. <laughs> <laughs> I I understand. <laughs> thought there was a horse stable nearby. Hmm. Hmm. Dang, looks like you're the one that's gonna be hoofing it. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe it's over the these hills. Hmm. Yeah. Horse, please. I wish you could hear me. <laughs> <laughs> Drive by. Oh, no, just... oh. oh, they have horses. Hello. Okay. Uh, boop, 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 oh. do boop, uh, do, do. <laughs> I need cover. Uh, you know what? Ice is, ice arrows might be better for this. Hey! Oh my god. Hey! He's fucking off. Maybe that's for the better. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. The guys on horses can, like, kill you in one hit very easily. Maybe it's not worth it. Mm -hmm. Frog! There we go. Oh, tired. <sighs> Chasing fog, got tired. I did kind of want their horse, though. Mm. It would have been a whole thing. He had a second guy. Yeah. It's not a wise battle. You gotta pick your fights when you're baby. Mm hmm. Oh, well, free wood! Mm hmm. Depending on what we hit. Stacked. Depending what we hit on the uh, roulette wheel, I may need a whole lot of wood. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. 30 wood, I think? Something. 30 sounds right. Yes, Terrytown is on the roulette. Yep. Do you need wood to buy the house? I thought that was just uh, money. No, you need the wood to start building houses in Terrytown, mm, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, another guy and a horse. Yeah, Two of them. Buying the house is also yep. on the roulette wheel. Yep. <laughs> you need 30 wood to buy the house. Oh, says. okay. Okay. Probably save. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, it's auto saving all the time, <laughs> but still. Man, if only. Oh, wait, there is only one Bacoblin here on a horse. Oh. And you don't even need to fight him, you just steal one of these horses. Yeah. If they would stop running away. Oh, no, there's a second Bacoblin there on a horse. Oh. Never mind. That's yeah. a bit too much. Especially. Yeah. Oh, a oh, third one. Third. <clears throat> He's far away, though. His other boys might not know. Yeah. His other boys. Yeah, he's really dividing himself from the rest of the group there. <laughs> oh, is he hunting after he's the boar? hunting pigs. 
Well, if he's not too far away now, I might be able to get him. Okay. Especially if you... Uh, <laughs> if I jump. If you parasail, yeah. Yeah. Oh, damn it! Fuck, <laughs> he's getting closer to that guy! Man, that fucking sucks. Damn it. Man narrowly avoided certain doom. Horse stable! Oh! There it is. Bazinga. This will be a really useful one to have because it's pretty damn close to the castle. Oh, oh yeah. Shit. All right. Oh, Beetle's here too. I can get more arrows. Oh, Cass is here. Wow. Even more arrows, sir. <laughs> See, this game has nice mid drifts. Uh, <laughs> Twilight, no, Twilight, Twilight, Twilight Princess. Princess has very hideous mid drifts. Because, like, over. half of the people in that game have weird, distended stomachs. Yeah, they look sick. Mm hmm. Yeah, the best part was that baby character, Mal Malo. Yeah, Malo's great. He's yeah, that's a good baby. Um. <laughs> a thread of dead celebrities that have been given Twitter blue, like uh -huh. when Mormons po posthumously baptize people. <laughs> uh, Pele, the soccer guy. Chadwick Boseman. Yeah. Kirstie Alley. Forgot she was dead. Hmm. Uh, John McAfee. That. That's funny. That's a. Funny, oh, right. That's a fucking weird one to do. Yep. Uh, Norm Macdonald. Fucked up. Michael Jackson. Fucked up. <laughs> Ridiculous. Michael Jackson even a real one? I thought he died before Twitter happened. Mm -hmm. Whatever, doesn't matter. Fucking stupid. <laughs> Get away from my shrine, you fucking goat! <laughs> oh yeah, Anthony Bourdain too, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Flash. I'm just constantly wondering when will Twitter finally like completely shut down? Yeah, just like not be there one day. That's gonna suck. Yeah. It's like so handy for keeping in touch with a ton of people. Like all everyone's business and stuff is on there. And like, how am I supposed to tell people I'm on podcasts? Mm -hmm. Come on. Elon, quit this stupid shit. <laughs> Someone assassinate that guy already. Come on. <laughs> Stop him from I don't think you can say that on Twitch without getting in trouble, honey. So please don't say that again. I said it in a funny accent. You know I'm joking. Uh-huh. <laughs> Come on, okay. Dark Biden. <laughs> Parody in Minecraft, etc. In Breath mm. of the Wild. <laughs> yep. Any of them drumsticks? Do any of the birds ever drop um, three drumsticks? Wouldn't that be fucked up? I don't think they do, but that would be funny. <laughs> it's like a 0.1% chance that they'll drop three drumsticks. And <laughs> yeah. you'll just be like, what the fuck? Huh? <laughs> that bird ate one other bird. <laughs> Half of one other bird. This hole. <laughs> Damn it. Tree! <laughs> You could run into those deer. I sure could. 
Nothing could stop you. Just the zigs and zags. Just the... Oh! oh despawned. He despawned. I don't think I've ever seen an animal despawn like that while playing the game on, like, the actual Switch, but maybe I'm wrong. I, I have, but not when I was that close to them. Yeah. Because usually they disappear just after, like, covering some sort of distance from, while running from you, I think. Yeah. Or at least that... Damn it. Oh, bush! <laughs> also getting a lot of stutters right around here, because it's yeah. an area I haven't been to before. Yeah, it's loading in. Okay. Is Drive-By still being a bit of a willful boy? He sure is, even though he's at full bond. He's just willful. Yeah. Okay. All right. This is the run. <laughs> yep, it sure is. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> just me and you, Fox. I got the keys, at least. Get out of here. You can enable a sync shader compilation to reduce stuttering if you haven't already. Hmm. <laughs> Garbage Nirvana played uh, It's Tail Time, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Actually, getting to the castle proper. <laughs> it's the castle. We're doing it. How disappointed would you be if you beat Ganon in this run? Second time? Yeah, I don't want to beat it this soon. Yeah, wouldn't that be funny, though? Know? I want to play the game for, I don't know, 10, 20 hours, maybe. <laughs> wow, Link, you really actually came. Wow. You're wearing a t-shirt? <laughs> That's what you came with? T-shirt? <laughs> you came dressed like this? <laughs> okay. All right, it's not raining or nothing. Nope. Good. The rest of this run is a no-hit run, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> It's a stealth run. I don't know if I can climb that right now. Maybe. Maybe. Well, I did make a potion to restore some stamina, so... Might. You just gotta really take your time. Yeah. Oh, I can yeah, do this. I can yeah, jump yeah. up here. Yeah. No prop. <laughs> you just get to the top and it's like... So it gets sniped immediately. Yeah, it gets sniped immediately. So... Crawl up and right directly into a guardian <laughs> anus. Uh, this is maybe the best or one of the best dungeons in a Zelda game ever. It's awesome. Just for woo, oh, how of. fucking big it is, That's how huge. many absurd, the, the absurd variety of the, uh, the routing, yeah, yeah, points of entry, crazy. Mm-hmm. Ooh. There you go. Okay. I can't climb those. Are too spiky. I can't climb that. Yeah, it's too tall. So. Yeah, this song is uh, incredibly cool. Oh, yeah. Whoa! Shit, yeah! Okay. What's up? Yeah, I believe, um... If you do go in the back through that, like, water entrance, there is a shrine there. There is, yeah. Part of my idea of doing this, though, is I just want to see how many different routes I can take. Mm. Uh oh. Mm. Mm. Assessing. Assessing. Got a bogey over there. Sure do. Okay. 
Pretty good uh, viewer retention for this stream, by the way. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. Yeah, thanks, everybody. It's been like hovering around 270, 280 for like the entire stream. It's pretty All right. wild. Now, oh, what I want to well, I do. I know what you're trying. I know what you're doing. Is. Little secret trick here. Yep. Oh, just Let's, a little. Just enough. I can, yeah. I love the spicy pepper trick. It kicks so much ass. It's a good trick. Alice Hachi says, I want to see this twink get obliterated. <laughs> he probably will. <laughs> Any second now. The poor man's Rivali's Gale, yes. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> So yes, if you didn't know, if you set a spicy pepper on fire, it makes a gale of wind. Mm-hmm. In a similar way that um, other fires in the game create uh, updrafts. Yep. Oh, here we go. Into the library. Now that's an entry point. I didn't know there was an entry point into the library from here. Oh. I feel like the your boy's going fast and weird sometimes. <laughs> yeah, I think I might want to go into the library to start avoiding all the guardians, yeah. but... I'm surprised you've only run into, like, two... And yeah, I haven't I'm seen you. Somehow taking the the no guardian route here. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Um. Oh. 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 Just barely noticed that under the water. I would laugh so hard if you dropped that on your head and died. <laughs> yeah. Yay! Hey. Some bomb arrows. Uh. Yeah, I'm a little nervous about being outside. Still, I'm gonna go yeah, into the library. Just, uh, go chill out in this nice chill library. Nothing bad can happen. Hmm. Please don't turn around. <laughs> <laughs> this is a sneaking mission, Link. Oh shit, he's got ice Ooh, arrows, he's got ice too. Arrows. Drop your shit. <laughs> ah! Ah! I keep getting fucked from that thing in particular, because I want to be cool about it. Don't be cool, be safe. Of course, I'm using the fucking weapon that where I can't pull my shield out. There. <laughs> Good bow. That was scary. Yep. Oh man. That was super dupe scary. More ice arrows. <laughs> <laughs> Thrilling. <laughs> um. He tried to tongue our twink. <laughs> I, ha I have to allow the phrase tongue our twink mm -hmm. specifically. Ah, fuck. Okay. Ho, ho, ho. Twenty. Damn it. Ooh. Fucking. Knock that shit off. Yeah. Give it to me. Yeah. Oh, hit him, hit him, hit him. Oh no, it's another guy! Look out! Drop your shit! Whoa! Haha. <laughs> Unrelenting! Unrelenting! Oh! Ah, God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I was doing good for you half a second. <laughs> uh. 
spin that wheel. Yep. Leave this castle. <laughs> you did fucking all right, though. Oh, At least you got to the fortress, yeah. Got to the castle. All right, what are we going to get? <laughs> Complete spiral jetty! Oh, boy. Okay. <laughs> okay, you got to take that off the, the list. There's only yeah, you're one. Right. You're right. There's only one complete spiral jetty, and we're doing it. <laughs> okay, I took it off the wheel. <laughs> so uh, we call it the spiral jetty. It is not called that. It is a certain shrine, shrine with a goofy name. But it is that shrine that, uh, if you look at it from the map, from up above, it is a big, uh, little, uh, a big little spiral. That you gotta do some stuff in there and not die. <laughs> we got a, we got a big walk. Okay. Yep, that's uh, all the way in Akala. Yep. Uh, leave. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Well, it was a pretty, pretty good little entry. Uh, yeah. Into the castle area, though. I got some stuff. I got three hundred rupees. I found some. Got some good weapons. I got some weapons and shit, yeah. Yeah. Got uh, bomb arrows. Yep. Uh, okay, so... I think the closest thing to the spiral jetty is this one. Yes. Well, I should go here, though, to get my horse. Oh, yeah, get your horse. Um, and also, we're not going to be unveiling the map unless we run into one of the uh, roulettes that say mm -hmm. to do that. It's one of the more common ones. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> uh, yeah, for those who just got here, this uh, Ganon run is not typical. We're doing something goofy with this Ganon run. Uh, the gimmick was, uh, as soon as you're possibly capable of doing so, go try to kill Ganon. If yep. you die on the way there it, from anything, we must do a task on the wheel, the roulette wheel, mm -hmm. before we are allowed to go back and try again. Come here, Drivesby. Drivesby! Going to the spiral jetty! This is not a drive by. Ha, 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 ha. His name is Drivesby. Drivesby, do you like art? <laughs> well, have Bloopy! I. Bloopy! Oh no! <laughs> what? Yeah! What is up, mister? All my rupees! <laughs> my bloopy rupees! <laughs> my bloopy rupees! <laughs> oh, some good snipes on that bloop. I really hope I didn't lose that purple one. There yeah, is. there it is. Oh, what fuck yes. Up. And a hearty radish. Rich boy. I never knew there was bloopies in this area. Yeah, me either. Oh, those guys are getting beat up again. Oh, yeah. Oh, one more rupee. Typical. Yeah. He's just running from him. <laughs> <laughs> Unhand them. <laughs> Spank. Yeah. Hey. Well, these are the truffle girls. I never do this, and never, it's so yeah. fucking cool. It's cool, and I, I always whiffed it. But yeah, still, be careful. <laughs> mm -hmm. There we go. It'd be so funny if it hit you and you died. <laughs> can that happen? I forget if you can hurt yourself with your own boomerangs. <laughs> can you hurt yourself with boomerangs? <laughs> well, look at the chin on this person, geez. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, something interesting for people who don't know is there's a 
ton of NPCs in this game, and they all look pretty different, especially in the face. Um, and the way they did that was super fucking clever. They hooked up their NPC system to the me system, which is still in the Switch. Yeah. And so it's just, they make a bunch of Miis and it translate it into the visual style they have here. Mm -hmm. Fucking clever. This has actually been brought up at least two times in the chat already. Oh, okay. <laughs> People love that, that chunk of trivia. It's really cool it's and a, clever. It's a great, yeah, it's great. <clears throat> Ooh. Yeah, I want some stealth stuff. Mm-hmm. You're gonna need it. Especially because, uh, who knows when you're gonna be able to get that Sheikah armor. <laughs> yeah. Sheikah stealth outfit. Who knows? Dribs B? Dribs B, heed my call. I say Dribs B as if he's related to Chadley. Chadley? Chadley? Dribs B? Dribs B? Chadley, your brother Dribs B is being quite willful. Jesby, don't walk into the fire. That's right, Chadley. You're related to a horse. <laughs> okay. Mm. How you doing? I'm cool. I was about to look up the spiral jetty and read it to everyone. Mm-hmm. Spiral Jetty is an earthwork sculpture constructed in April 1970 that is considered to be the most important work of American sculptor Robert Smithson. Smithson documented the construction of the sculpture in a 32-minute color film also titled Spiral Jetty. Built on the northeastern shore of the Great Salt Lake near Rosal Point in Utah, entirely of mud, salt crystals, and basalt rocks, basalt? Spiral Jetty forms a 1,500 foot long, 460 meter, 15 foot wide, 4.6 meter, counterclockwise coil jutting from the shore of the lake. Basalt. Basalt. Oh, shit. Oh. I got bucked off. Thrown from your willful child's back. In 1999, the artwork was donated to the Dia Art Foundation and is one of 11 locations and sites they manage. Since its initial construction, those interested in its fate have dealt with questions of proposed changes in land use in surrounding in the area surrounding in the area surrounding the sculpture. In order to preserve the work, Dia Art Foundation asks that visitors do not take existing rocks from the artwork, make fire pits, or trample vegetation. There are no facilities at the site, so visitors must carry out any waste with them. It's a big piece of shit art project that costs <laughs> like a bajillion dollars to make. Yeah. And it's in a place that's like really unaccessible and no one can go to, and then they don't even put a fucking porter potty there. Yeah. Right? Like, Robert Smithson, you fucking jackass. <laughs> It's one of the, the least accessible pieces of art ever, and it mm -hmm. makes it pisses me off. What about earthquakes? You don't know a lot about Utah, do you? <laughs> Stop oh. looking at me. Oh. I want to just keep going in a straight line, but all this shit's too rocky for my horse. Oh man. Maybe I'll find another stable soon. No. Oh, oh man, this, this, this sucks. The boys are back in town. I know there are Mormons. That's about it. And there's no earthquakes. There's nothing. <laughs> there's nothing exciting in Earth in Utah, including earthquakes. There's mm. none of those are there. It'd be very strange. I mean, maybe there was like at some point an earthquake, but. Mm. I had to learn about the spiral jetty in art school, and I had to watch the 32-minute documentary of this guy jerking his fucking pud over his own, <laughs> his own thing he was building. Mm-hmm. Thanks for subbing, Torgo823. Thank you. Uh,
No, this this guy like if you ever watch his documentary, he's pretty full of himself. <laughs> mm-hmm. Smithson reportedly chose the Rosal Point site based on the blood red color of the water and its connection with the primordial sea. Fuck off. <laughs> it's Utah. Fuck off. The red hue of the water is due to the presence of salt tolerant bacteria and algae that thrive in the extreme 27% salinity of the lake's north arm, which was isolated from freshwater sources by the building of a causeway by the Southern Pacific Railroad in 1959. Wow. Yeah, Automod doesn't mind if we jerk the pud. That's good. <laughs> mm hmm. Ah, uh, however. Uh, a ass motherfucker, I need to allow, though. Because <laughs> spider hyphen man said sommelier ass motherfucker. Yeah. Smithson was reportedly attracted to the Rosal Point site because of the stark anti-pastoral beauty and industrial remnants from nearby Golden Spike National Historic Site, as well as an old pier and a few unused oil rigs. While observing the construction of the piece from a helicopter, yes, this guy also had access to a helicopter. Mm -hmm. Of course. Of course. Smithson repeat, reportedly remarked, et in Utah ego. <laughs> As a counterpoint to the, pastor, the pastoral Baroque painting, et in Arcadia ego, by Nicolas Poussin. Wow. A big, big fart huffer, this guy. Ugh. Big fart huffer. I had to read his book about... He wrote a book about this thing. Mm -hmm. He made a documentary about this thing. And he made the thing. Three useless things. <laughs> and then he died in a fucking airplane crash. Goodbye. Oh, my God. <laughs> Man, harsh. <laughs> he just made art you didn't like. <laughs> Jesus I'm Christ. Fucking, oh, my God. <laughs> He's dead. He don't care. <laughs> He's dead and he was rich. Who cares? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm almost to the shrine that I just want for the, the warp point. <laughs> so, uh, this guy constructed it, uh, twice, uh, because, <laughs> so he, he hired, uh, some nearby Utah dude to, like, haul all these fucking rocks. <laughs> like, yeah. About 7,000 tons of rocks, mm -hmm. uh, to this lake uh, to arrange it in this little spiral. Um, and, uh, you know, uh, the first time they built it, it took about a week. And then after contemplating the result for two days, <laughs> Smithson called the crew back and had the shape altered to its present configuration, which was an effort requiring moving 7,000 tons of rock. <laughs> wow. In half the time, too. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't like how it's down. Yeah, I know you just moved 7,000 tons of rocks, but like, can it, it doesn't. Be different? Can it be different? Like, <laughs> client from hell. I have to move all these rocks different for this guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, for those of you just tuning in, this is a Rush the Castle ASAP run. However, every time Little Link dies on the way to rushing the castle. Uh, we gotta do a little task that is determined by a roulette wheel with about 50 things on it, and it landed on complete the Spiral Jetty. And I've been reading the Wikipedia article for Spiral Jetty because uh, I didn't realize this was an obscure reference, but it, of course it is. <laughs> When you dislike something, but it's a focus of your education, you develop a deep resentment for something that isn't that big of a deal. That's why I hate brutalism. Mm. Absolutely, travelerism. Ah, nature. Natur. We're getting, we're getting there. I'm getting there. We're getting there. Where's this dang spiral jetty? Whoa. Oh. 
Forgot about those cows. Those are cows too. Yep. Um, so yeah, the spiral jetty, um, was submerged in a lake by the time Dia, uh, acquired it. Um, mm. but beginning in the early, uh, 2000s, a uh, sustained drought in Utah caused the water levels to recede, and the spiral jetty became visible for the first prolonged period in its history, and as a result, uh, it got more popular, and people actually visited the dang thing. Mm. It sounds like Jess is spiral petty. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, secular strategy. <laughs> um, the issue of preservation has been complicated by ambiguous statements by Smithson, who expressed an admiration for entropy in that he intended his works to mimic, mimic earthly attributes in that they remain in a state of arrested disruption and not be kept from destruction. However, you're not allowed to remove rocks from it. <laughs> Don't you do it. Oh, we just barely see it now, I think. Oh, yeah, that's the little chunk of it there. Yeah, he didn't care that much about entropy and, and nature if he made the entire construction crew re <laughs> rearrange the rocks. <laughs> uh. Oh, talking about the documentary. The film documented the construction process and also formed an ancillary artwork. Smithson combines his interest in geology, paleontology, astronomy, mythology, and cinema. This book is go like, it's just like a unhinged, like really artsy Tumblr rant where it's like everything means everything actually. Yeah, I almost killed myself <laughs> just one, now. Close one. Stating that he had an interest in documenting, quote, the Earth's history. In conjunction with the film sequences of the jetty, Smithson incorporates footage of dinosaurs in a natural history, mu history museum and the ripped pages from a history text. During this scene, Smithson refers to the institutions of history, quote, the Earth's history seems at times like a story recorded in a book, each page of which is torn into small pieces. Many of the pages and some of the pieces of each page are missing. Whoa! Sorry. <laughs> Smithson's narrative supports an alternative view of historical discourse and the art object's placement or production outside of the museum institution. His writings also indicate that the helicopter film sequences over the jetty were a method of, quote, recapitulating the scale of the jetty. By visually disorienting the viewer, Smithson is able to negate a time and place for the materiality of the artwork, or create what he calls a cosmic rupture. Uh. Through this state, the viewer is meant to be unable to categorize or classify the site, and will be left in a state free from the dialect of history. I'll show you a cosmic rupture, waka waka. <laughs> Like a cosmic prolapse. <laughs> uh, yeah, words are supposed to mean things, but not 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 this man. <laughs> you don't need to. That don't mean. You don't need to mean stuff. If if you're rich enough and you got enough art cred, you don't need to mean. You don't gotta uh, make any sense ever. Yeah. He put a bunch of rocks in a spiral. <laughs> yeah. And said and said in multiple media how clever he was for doing it. That's why I don't like the guy. Mm hmm. I, I mean, the art is just fine. It's cool. It looks neat. Uh, but the guy is... <laughs> it, he, he wrecked it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Here we are, I think. No, this ain't it. Where the fuck is the spiral jetty in this game? Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> I know it. it's I know it's on this. That's it. No, no all shit. Mm. 
No, I know it's on this side of the map, though. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't think it's further that way. It's west of Death Mountain, I hear. West of Death Mountain? No. Oh, sorry, east. <laughs> east of Death Mountain. Near okay. Terrytown. Near Terrytown. Okay, so I just need to go more, whew, more north. More Akala. Uh, I suppose this is the one downside of these challenges. Sometimes I just have to go for a while to get to my thing. Yeah, like you were worried that like this wasn't like enough time spent on things. It's like Dah. yeah, I know. I, I was. Yeah, I know. It. I know. I was, I'm just telling the chat. I'm not rubbing it in or anything. I'm just mm -hmm. telling the chat that I said I don't know. I think. Uh, you're not taking into account all the walking you might have to do here. <laughs> yeah, Ugh, yeah, I went way too... Oh, uh, way too south. South. Son of a bitch. You gonna put a waypoint down or anything? Kind of like keep it uh, like on your... Yeah, I should. Your little blip radar there? Not, not a sword. Yeah, is the chat allowed to give hints? I don't really know. We didn't talk about this. Eh, eh. Maybe. <laughs> we won't be mad if you do. Okay, let's yeah. at least uh, come, come down Sure, yeah. yeah. Here's one of the Korok seed puzzles that uh, I didn't realize were how to do them for a very long time. Oh, really? Yeah. Oop. Oh, they all just only have the one. Yep. Oh, I thought it was going to fall off. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh... Yeah. This way, I suppose. Mm -hmm. It would be cool if Koroks were real things. Yeah. Here's the question. Oh, there's some luminous stones here. Mm -hmm. May as well. Here's the question. If Koroks were real, would they be a pet or would they be a friend? Hmm. Oops. Damn it. Leave me! Oh my god! All the boys. Ow! Oh. Dick! I take it! God damn it! <laughs> yeah. Now that's the the, the money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, get, I got it. I did do my Duolingo today. Thank you for asking, Spicy Minton. I, I did, did my Duolingo as well. I did it much earlier. Same. Yeah, I feel like they would be like a little... Hmm. They might be halfway between a pet and a friend. Like a Pokemon. Yeah. A Pokemon is halfway between a pet and a friend. Yeah. Right? We, we are learning Japanese just a little bit. Mm -hmm. I wish it was teaching me more useful things than like, there are seven chairs in the room. <laughs> <laughs> Don't really need to know that. I would like to know like, uh, you know, how to order food. Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. Koroks can say full t sentences, but so can Meowth. I think they'd be in like a, <laughs> I think they'd be in like a Meowth sort of genre of pet friend. Uh-huh. Oh. Oh! Hello. <laughs> I look, didn't even mean to, where we are. to come here. Uh... Oh yeah, there's this little thing they added that just shows like where 
the route I've taken so far. Oh, yeah, like Path of the Hero. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this will be fun to play once I finish this yeah, little thing. It's good. Yeah. I know, you're right though, Anodyne. That is like they're 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 teaching me grammar with those sentences. It's just that I'm I get frustrated easily with the grammar situation. Like Jupiter Stars said, uh, that they got frustrated with Duo because it was just teaching phrases and not how the grammar works, but you're supposed to like infer through repetition how the grammar does work because it reminds you of other sentences they have parroted back at you. Yeah. Um, is it ideal? Mm, not for everyone. Um, yeah. And also, like, you can you can always go into the, uh, the comments of any sentence and you'll see people being like, okay, can you explain how the grammar works on this one? And there'll be a ton of people, like, saying, like, why this is happening, why you use this in this case. Yeah. It is free, so I can't be mad about it, you know? Oh, shit, it's starting to rain. Oh, man. I wish Duolingo had a uh, hiragana, katakana, like, only mode that was just, like, showing you hiragana and katakana and being like, what word are we trying to make out of this? Uh, Pizza yeah. or whatever, or the name of a company or whatever. Because, uh, like, I'm pretty good at it, but I, I can always be better. There's, like, I want to say there's, like, four to six, like, hiragana and katakana that I swap by accident still. Mm -hmm. Here's the uh, te. Oh shit, I'm still gonna get cold here. It's like ultra cold here. It's freezing. Uh, it's really damn. cold. I, I gotta go back. I can't go this, this way. Is, this is too cold. Ow. Ouch. <laughs> Ow. Drop down. Okay. Oh, if I just keep thinking about the spiral jetty one day, it will be here. <laughs> yep. Uh, do I know any kanji? I mean, a couple. I wouldn't be able to draw them. Um, yeah. And I, you know, don't see the practical purpose of knowing how to draw them anyway. Mm hmm You know, for, for me just being a casual learner who just wants to, like, get by in the country. Which, you know, you can do without knowing Japanese. Because, you know, if you're going to, like, Tokyo or whatever, most things are in English, too. Yeah. Um, yeah, I can, I can recognize some main ones. Very basic ones. Cat, dog, big and small, and, mm -hmm. you know, meat. Certain uh, weather conditions. <laughs> yeah, I'm way behind on you. I'm still learning, like katakana just barely mm -hmm. you could you could honestly on the trip like it's a 14 hour flight you could learn katakana in 14 hours yeah <laughs> it's it's not that bad mm -hmm. but tears of the kingdom will be out i know yeah i'm just i'm just saying that like you know before tears of the kingdom comes out you could spend a day and just be like okay yeah. i'm gonna nail this <laughs> Okay, uh... So, oh, I think it's, like, over here-ish. Yeah, still got a ways. Oh, Jesus. I know it's cold down there, too. This map is very, very big. Yeah, it sure is. Don't know what I'm gonna do about that, but we'll figure <laughs> out when I get there. Uh oh Ah! Uh, no! Oh, there's a high knock. Sorry. Wow. Man, I did not consider that the spiral jetty was so far away. Uh-huh. What a shame we landed on this one so early. <laughs> yeah. Dang, we couldn't just get the dog selfie one and be over with it. Yeah. Well, dog selfie would have taken some work, too, because I don't have the camera yet. Oh, you're right. I would have to go get the oh, camera to take a dog selfie. That's 
Yeah, that's um. God damn it! Oh my god, it's so chilly. It's so chilly. I need to fucking cook some. Do I? I don't have anything that makes me warm. No. Any food? No, I do no, not. No, you don't. Shannon B is in Japan right now on vacation. <gasps> Nice. While it hasn't been a problem, there's definitely less English than I felt like I was led to believe. Mm. Uh, where are you at? Are you in Tokyo or... Oh, where? I don't think the pumpkin stew heats you up, no. No. It's a toughness recipe. And uh, none of these things have uh, dual effects. That would be too OP. Mm-hmm. May as well boop that shrine on your way. Yep. Yeah, I have done a bunch of Wani Kani. I've fallen off it for a very long time, though, because I realized, like, yes, there's a jillion, million, billion kanji to learn, uh, and I'm not going to need to know those things very much, uh, because I need to know grammar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I need to know how to talk. Damn it, being able to read is cool, but oh. Nice, enjoy Tokyo. We too will be in Tokyo. <laughs> Spinal Jetty. Spinal Jetty. I mean, to be fair, like, there's other things on this uh, roulette that are also in the far corners of the map. Yeah. Like, defeat a Mulduga. <laughs> mm hmm. Oh, is this the one surrounded by spikes? No. Maybe. Yes, it yeah, is. Yeah, it is, yeah. Damn it. Uh, this one's involved. Sure is. I don't think I want to deal with mm, it. Unless you could just land in there, but... But it's surrounded by Lizzle foes, too. A, that's like... the whole thing, yeah. A lot of drama. Well, I think you, uh, Snow, you'd be able to... Download it digitally on your switch. I presume you could get uh, Tears of the kingdom that way while you're out of the country. Yep uh, If you die does it get replaced by another task? No, nope that task must be completed Even if you die along the way with to that task Okay, I think I'm past most of the cold shit <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> it would be funny to get a French physical copy. That is that is true. It might not be compatible with your Switch, though, right? I don't know. I, don't I know. forget if the Switch is region-free or not. It'd be very funny if a boar killed you. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Got him. <laughs> Got the little hoe. Burger Bonanza, first time chatter, says, Hello, Chip. Long time occasional viewer. Thank you for years of free entertainment. Oh, well, thank you. Uh, anyway, whenever I see your name these days, my brain forces me to say Chet, ch chet Chism out loud. <laughs> I don't know what you can do with that information, but I felt the need to tell you. Enjoy the Zelda. <laughs> it's an evil parallel version of me, Chet. <laughs> chet Chism. Have I watched any of the Gundams? Just G Gundam, the best one. <laughs> All the way through, and I kept telling her, like, they're, they're, I forget how far into the show, but basically once, um, Schwartz Bruder is introduced. Schwartz Bruder. And it's just like, ooh, he, he's always, you know, masked and stuff. And it's just Spo like. Spoilers for G Gundam, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it's like, ooh, Schwartz Bruder is like, somebody else in the show in disguise and i was we were playing a game where she was like trying to guess who schwartzbruder could possibly be and i was giving her hints like 
uh, uh, you know, okay, it's someone who's been in the show before, X episodes ago, blah, 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 and she was, like, losing her fucking mind because she was guessing so many people. I was just like, nope. Because I was like, it has to be our boy's brother, right? Because, like, da-da-da. But then there was a scene where they were in like the same room together or something yeah. like they were in the same scene together so Schwartz like, Bruder oh. and his brother who could not therefore I, I, he he got crossed off the suspect list because of that yeah Ooh, i put myself in a bad oh spot my God, what the fuck is this hon <laughs> mm. it's raining you're in the danger zone oh god oh um, but yeah, it was his brother, and like that was a hologram or something in the same. No, or there was a second one because of uh, Dark Gundam cells. Uh huh. Sure. Yeah. He made a copy of himself that was the remaining good guy bits of him. I just, I just feel like when you tell this story, you tell it in a way that makes me sound like the dumbest slut alive. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Like oh wow. Topaz. Dumb ho didn't know that Schwartz. Bruder was the dark brother of I, the black brother. It's, it's just funny how it, is, it was uh, flummoxing me. Like, don't get me wrong, it was fucking me up. But it was because those two characters were in the same scene, and I was like, yeah. well, it can't be him, and that was driving me crazy. Yeah. Man, there's a guy under that rock, and that rock is needed to make another little guy appear right oh, next really? to it. really? Crazy. Pretty sure. No, it's an arrow pointing to it. Oh, haha. -ha. Or you can put it at the end of the arrow and see if it does anything. <laughs> yeah, I think it's just an... Yeah, just looking. Just an arrow. Hey, okay, there's a little guy that way. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I thought you said shorts, Bruder. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Hmm. Rain. Will it work at this very precise spot, I wonder? Hmm. And will it roll? God damn it, it'll just roll. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> we call this the old slippery pep. Yep. Also, a great thing about G Gundam is a uh, Chibity Crockett. Chibity, yeah, Chibity Crockett is wonderful. Damn it! I was really hoping that was just enough of an outcropping to cover the ring because you can do that. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, I put myself in a bad spot, and it's never going to stop raining here because it's close to Zora Town, yep. where it's mm -hmm. always raining for it's plot always, reasons. Always raining. Slippy Peppy, it's a Star Fox reference. <laughs> Just get up to that fucking slope. Ah! Fuck! Gotta fucking go around. You gotta go around, huh? Well, wait. Wait. No, um, maybe. I can make it. I can do it. <laughs> I am an expert at climbing in the rain. Mm -hmm. Look at him go. There's so many. Parts of mountains that are angled just so that you can actually run on them. Mm -hmm. Ah! What Nintendo doesn't want you to know. <laughs> you you can do the speed run trick where you whistle. It gives you infinite uh, grippies yeah. on there too, running up. But we're not cheaters. Mm-hmm. There we go. I'm doing it. <laughs> Link is a Bethesda horse. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Making our way over this fucking mountain. <laughs> See that mountain? You can climb that. Unfortunately, uh -huh. you have to. Please, God, show me the spiral jetty. Spiral jetty. Shit. 
Show me Jetty. <laughs> <laughs> wow, guys oh. with electric weapons wow. down there. What the fuck? Hmm. If they weren't so far down, I'd be a little tempted. <laughs> right, there's this shit, and then the spiral jetty's on the other on end the of other this stuff. On the other side of it, yeah. Yeah. Weggy did one last fan art. <sighs> No, Chadley, no! Chadley! Taking my horse! That's so funny! <laughs> Thank you so much, Wag. There he goes. <laughs> what a rascally lad. Oh man, that's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love you. Thank you, Wags. Red Centennial saying, see that mountain? We placed it there to punish your intrepid spirit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 We're okay. getting there a bit. For some reason, without having gotten a raid, so far as I know, mm -hmm. we just got like 30 more viewers. <laughs> huh. I don't know why. All right. Cool. Finally, a good s spot to just glide for a bit. Phew. Another Korok. Damn. 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 It is comfier streaming out here. <laughs> it is. It also gets uh, way less hot. We don't have your desk cramming us in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's way less hot out here. <laughs> Ooh. Pissy. Pissy? Spiral Jenny, I see it. Spiral Jenny. There it is. You slut, we found you. <laughs> Yes, a find X number of Koroks is on the wheel. Uh, we had it set to a modest find five Koroks. Yep. So not not a ton, but you know, not not a one and done easy peasy one. Dog meat. Should you, since you're near Terrytown, get that shrine? Yeah. Cause you're like, like, right next to it, right? Am I crazy? That's the Terrytown one? Um, no, there's, um, maybe it is actually. Like, and we're coming at it from a weird angle? Maybe. It's like just misty enough that you can't tell. Mm -hmm. Finding easy slash nearby Koroks ahead of time could be detrimental to you in the future. I don't know, there's 800 of the fuckers. Yeah. And if, it, if, if we play this game long enough that <laughs> that becomes a problem, then we, we got problems playing video games at that point. Oh yeah, this is the Terry Town one. Yep. Little, little shrine guys there. Little Korok baby. Mm-hmm. Da <laughs> Oh, 900, right, 900. Ah. My bad. <laughs> We're also not visiting any great fairies unless told to mm -hmm. by the wheel. Yep, because there's one right, right there. there. Oh, we're finally about to do it. The spiral jetty. Spiral jetty.
Now, what do you think is the worst thing on this wheel? Like the hardest, longest thing to do. Oh, lo hardest and longest? I uh, think it would, it would just be like, do one of the divine beasts. Yeah, the divine beasts are big time sinks. Um, Cause the, those are those are weighted uh, to be rarer. Yeah. For what it's worth. They're like the rarest things. This one was like a two or three rarity, wasn't it? Yeah. One, I think this one, was a two. One being the rarest, so we accidentally rolled a two and got a really involved one. <laughs> a fairly involved one. Yep. Do you think Tears of the Kingdom will have more Koroks? Probably. I think so. What do you think? Yeah, I wonder if they'll still do the seeds thing or if they'll do something new. Up, up in the sky. Seeds in the sky. Yeah. Or just an entirely new little guy that has seeds in the sky and seeds underground or something Maybe. something like that, you know? Yeah. Right, I almost forgot to actually do the spell, Jody. You have to come up here first. Yeah, you gotta get a little thing. Gotta get the orb. More hardy radishes? What? Oh, frig. I forgot they do that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, there they are. <laughs> the updrafts yes. through their body parts <laughs> into the fucking sky. So cool. Nice shot. Thank you. Yep, we gotta schlep this orb into the spiral jetty. Who boy. Oh boy. There's a lot of problems along the way. Oh, a, oh wait, no, never mind. <laughs> yeah, there sure is. Yeah, you know. I mean, you can just very slowly. If I had a Korok leaf, mm. it would be a little easier maybe, but. No. I think uh, when I did this, I um, made ice blocks like pretty much across the circumference or yeah. the, the diameter, the radius. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn it. Because, yeah, this happened. Nice one. Oops. Not oh, as not, much not of a nice one. Not as nice one. of a one. <laughs> No. <laughs> Damn it. No. Oh, stop, stop it. <laughs> Knock that shit off. Perimeter? <laughs> no, perimeter is the whole way around. I mean, the... The, the diameter. The diameter. The, the radius. <laughs> I, I got a 66 in math. Yeah. 65 was failing. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, towards the center. Cut across. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Beeline. Bee As a crow flies. You know. <laughs> Outside to middle is radius. Okay, okay. Oh! Damn it. Oh. You hate to see it. Oh, they got shit on fire. Whoa, good shot. Wow. Whoa, dude. Oh, throwing a rock. Oh, okay, we've only got one big problem now. <laughs> oh, I put his thing out. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Wow, didn't know that could happen. That was fucking good. I don't know why I've never seen that happen before. <laughs> <laughs> Slide it away. <laughs> you know what? I should also first grab my orb, my precious orb. My orb. Um, yeah, like, can you, like, float it and, and push it across? I mean, it does float, yeah. 
but I want to go to this campfire and rest oh, until it's, it's not day. Yeah. So all these fucking stall enemies are not on my ass oh my God, as well. I pick up the things. All right. You're bothering me. I don't know if it's going to be here in the morning. I don't uh -huh. know. Oh, just sit and wait. Mm. Ah! <laughs> Raining. <laughs> lightning. Oh, no, lightning. Oh, geez. Okay, okay. Okay. You're fine. You're fine. It's good. Oops. Jeez. Oh. Oh. There you go. Nice. Good one. Oh, I gotta fucking get back up here, though. If I just do it on the edge... Will it like, keep on rolling off? This is how you do it. Yep. You might think, like, oh, just go around. No, there's like, the, there's tons of guys, and it's longer than you think it is. Yeah, it's this really is long. big. It was a very, very long route. Alright, looking good. Mm -hmm. Well, hopefully maybe uh, some of these guys have metal stuff on them and... Mm. Oh man, there's little foes and... Yup. You're close though. Yup. This orb God, isn't... all this lightning. This orb isn't metal, is it? No, I don't think so. <laughs> if you get hit, you're immediately dead. Yup. No one look at me. Do you not perceive me? Just a twink in his orb? If this were metallic, he could throw it at the enemies and get them zapped that way. Uh, true. Look at that, look at that. No problem. Now we gotta do the shrine. Not for my man. <laughs> And again, if uh, if we die during a task, that does not mean we roll again. That means we still have to complete the task. Yep. The only ta the only task where our deaths change what we're doing is when we are trying to go to Ganon. I don't even remember what the shrine is like. Uh, yeah, I have no idea. Man, it's almost midnight. Yeah. God damn it. How long do you want to stream? Nah. Yeah. Okay. Half hour? Hour? Oh, oh you just get right. it! You just, hey! get, you just get stuff. It's a blessing! Don't remember if this is a weapon or not. Ooh. Oh, it's a big core. Okay. Right. If you have a roll going to... The Hateno Tech Lab. Oh, yeah. That'll eventually come in handy. Mm hmm. Bee, me, me. <laughs> Back to Ganon. Mm hmm. Done did it. Back to Ganon. Not too bad you dropped one of your weapons and didn't, <laughs> didn't take it. It was a crappy weapon. Oh, okay. We're gonna get that Ganon this time. Oh yeah. We're gonna get him. Three hearts and a t-shirt still. We're gonna do it. So. Three hearts and a t-shirt. He's gonna regret ever coming back. <laughs> when he gets beat by a kid with three hearts and wearing a t-shirt. <laughs> That's not what I want to do. Um, yeah. Chat, remind me, when you're mixing the hearty radish to get, like, the extra yellow hearts, does adding more hearty radishes increase the amount of yellow hearts? I think it does. Yes. I believe so, yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
Okay. Entering tough boy mode. <laughs> I just need to make another heat resistance thing in case I am on top of a fucking cold ass mountain again yeah. that even my shirt cannot protect me from. <laughs> there you there go. There we go. Ten and a half minutes. Very That's nice. pretty good. Um. Another dead guy who got verified. John McCain. <laughs> Good news, though. I forgot he was dead. Yay. Yeah. Fuck that guy. <laughs> Big... Big defense boost. Okay. Hi. Hi. Just got mm. back to be whining to again. Oh. Oh. Drivby. We have three hearts and a t-shirt. <laughs> One day we'll have armor, but only if I roll for it. <laughs> oh, I really should have included um, <laughs> the link to the fucking thing. Mm. Stupid. I'm gonna delete that. Going to find it again yeah. on the Wegworth account. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Twitch.tv. Mm hmm. Let's check season. Not die again, please. <laughs> <laughs> like, first five steps to the castle, <laughs> obliterated. Obliterate that twink. <laughs> if I may suggest going in that way I suggested the first time simply because it will give you a shrine mm -hmm. that is like right there so right there you don't mm -hmm. have to go out here get the horse yeah. <laughs> that was like in the back side right yeah the back of the castle mm-hmm everyone in the chat doing <laughs> for some reason like the the number of, of uh, people watching went down in real time in a weird in a weird way it was like by 30 again what something, the fuck? something weirds going on on twitch's end <laughs> mm. coffee think about bed bed's cool to think about Too fascinated by this to go to bed. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. Scared for you. I can't cross that right now. Jesus. <laughs> wow. Quit it. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Man, excellent dodging. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> tree, 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 tree. Breaking line of sight. 
<laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> oh no. I also like how that Fuck. deer. <gasps> God damn it! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> Well, back to the wheel. <laughs> what are we going to get this time? <laughs> Spin that wheel. Five Koroxies. <laughs> there you go. No problem. Just get them nearby here and then you'll be closer. Yeah. Fucking. <laughs> We should put on the wheel for the next stream, like, one or two or three, like, just go back to Ganon. Right. <laughs> like, free, you get another free try. <laughs> uh-huh. Fuck. <laughs> there was such a fun, like, when you got hit by that laser, Link was in, like, a weird point of his animation where it looked like he did, like, a little, like, boop, like yeah, a little, yeah. little shift up, a little jump. Oh, five Korok seeds, eh? Five Korok seeds, no problem. So some of these tasks are removed from the wheel after completing them. Yeah. These are tasks that you can only do once, like completing the spiral jetty that is now off the roulette. Mm -hmm. However, for things like uh, get five Korok seeds, uh, there's uh, almost a thousand of those, so we can do that over and over and over again. Yep. So yup. Korok seeds, eh? Hmm. Oh. Hey, uh, what the? Oh, I don't want to blow oh, the trees up. Oh, don't blow up the trees. Yeah, just just fight them like normal. <laughs> Same as the last one. Oh, yeah. Look at that. For those of you new, if you die during a task, you still have to do the task. The only thing that gets reset is if you die during Ganon. Trying to get to Ganon will make it re make you have to do the roulette. Yep. We need to put the rules, like, somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Every, like, ten minutes I'm reiterating this, this one very valid question, but yeah, like, that's obviously, uh, worth asking. Mm-hmm. Someone needs to keep count of how many Korok seeds I've grabbed, because <laughs> I know I'm going to forget. Yeah, we need a exclamation point rules command. No, no, it's not you. Don't apologize. It's not your fault. You came in late. It's fine. I just, I just, I just linked the the, twi the Twitch on on Twitter. So like, of course, you you don't know. You just got here. Mm -hmm. Well, you could update the task to say get four Korok seeds. Mm-hmm. Bit tedious though. Yeah. Ah, well, in that case, I rescind my mercy toward you, Red Centennial. <laughs> they came in early but left periodically. <laughs> Sorry, Fox. Oh, free meat. Well, uh oh. Hey. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh no. Brimsby. Brimsby. Drives by. Brimsby. <laughs> Drivby. Drivby. I keep saying Drivsby, but Drivsby. it's not drives by, it's drive by. Drive by. <laughs> there's gotta be a Korok seat around here. This yeah, seems like a there, place. there's there's gotta. Uh, I think there's also one like near that um stable, but mm -hmm. not sure. Yeah. Wow, look at those fish swim. Yeah! Do they know when you're looking at them? Do they do a little, <laughs> jump? do they do a little jumpy because you're looking? I don't know. Self-aware fish showing off. <laughs> yeah, can you go up to the, the smoke thing? I forget what's up there. 
So oh. there's a person up there, but I wonder if there's yeah, a Korok for... situation up there, too. And I also, for... it's a vantage point. Yeah, I forget what this person is doing. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I wanted to be cool. Well, it looked very nice, dear. Stealing your rice. <laughs> Okay, just mm -hmm. another lady uh, reiterating vantage points. Mm -hmm. Oh, a whole seared steak. There's a steak in a box. That's a steakum. A steakum, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. Boop. Look and at that. Then, look at that. Um. I bet there's one on that hill. Oh, wait. I think that's one. Right? Uh, Oops. I don't, I don't know. It looked like a stump. I thought that was the, um... You know, when you get the little blocks uh, that you got to put on top of each other to make oh, a pattern? I can't tell from here. Maybe. 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 It looks like it just a ridge to me. Like a chunk of that Yeah. very suspicious looking fort. Whoa. Damn it. <laughs> there, I think? Mm -hmm, that mm -hmm. skull rock? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Sus. Mm-hmm. I love how much the foxes, like, pop on the green. Yeah. Of the fields, so pretty. I like the art direction in this game in general. Mm-hmm. It's a very pretty game. I really like, you know, the quality of the atmosphere, like, lends itself to making these colors more pastel. Mm-hmm. They flow very nicely. Let's not donk it too hard. It is a single donk. Yeah, it's pretty, it is pretty wild that people thought Wind Waker looked bad, but it was, uh, you know... Oh, no! Boop. It was a different time, a time of, of boys and men. <laughs> and no colors. Just gotta get it out of the way. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, now you can push it, now you can push it. Three left. Yeah, everybody didn't want kitty games anymore. Games are not just for kids. Mm -hmm. And color, colors are for babies. <laughs> I'm a man. I want gray and brown. <laughs> Maybe blue. <laughs> Maybe. Ah. Please don't strike my horse dead. Mm, maybe I won't go towards the guardian. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. Oh, that's the rock. Stuff. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be a whole situation, isn't it? Yeah. Ooh, got spikes? I don't remember this place at all. Hmm. Oh, ah. uh oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Jeez. I don't super remember what's going on here. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. This is not terribly familiar to me. Huh. 
Are there guys that live here? I don't know. Hmm. Huh. It's gotta be a fort. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a fort, but yeah. I just don't remember this fort very much. No, not at all. Well, yeah, yep, there's some guys, yeah. Yep. Hmm. Mm -hmm. What if I should deal with these guys or not? I don't know. It doesn't feel worth it for Korok seed, because you're not going to get a Korok seed from them. Yeah. You know? It's yeah. It's going to be a, you know, weapons and stuff, but... Yeah, I don't... Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's slippy. I don't think I'll deal with that right now. It seems like a lot of drama that you don't that you don't need. I will mark this with just, like... A skull, though. Yeah, it is a skull. <laughs> it's a very accurate pin. Yeah. Uh, I love this horse does not get spooked by lightning <laughs> <laughs> happening 10 feet away from it. Yeah. Very brave in certain circumstances. Yeah. Chew's popping up, though. Whoa. Mm hmm. This uh, big beefy tree might have like a rock on top of it. Yep. If you can climb the trees. Oh. oh the beefier went to the right. This one? Yeah. The beefer. <laughs> Damn it! Ah, oh, shit! It's not happening right now. If you climb underneath the big, uh, the big branch. Yeah. Well, it's gonna stop raining pretty soon, anyways. I. Oh, mm, I thought that worked. I think it has to be a bigger mm, more of crop overhang. than that. Uh, I don't think there's anything up there anyway. No. Nope. God damn it. Some eggs up here. You know what I feel about those? I sure do. You said the word. <gasps> I love eggs. There, there you go. What if I can't go up trees? <laughs> Man, once you're actually looking for Koroks, where they at? Yeah. Hmm. There you are, Drew the Bee. <laughs> Stop eating grass. It's time to go. Spit that out. <laughs> You gonna get that shrine for the heck of it? Yeah. Oh, it's a puddle. Calm down. <laughs> Two inches of water. I can't. No, yeah, I don't like it. It's too deep. I'm basically a Clyde Oh, God, oh, it's, it's the flower one. one. Oh, there's a Ooh, treasure chest, though. Just drop it on her head. Kill her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Take her out. Save us all the trouble. <laughs> okay. Wow, you're raking up the dough here. Mm-hmm. Don't, e don't even talk to her. No. Nah. She doesn't even give you anything, I don't think. It's just like, don't touch the flowers. I'll kill you. Mm-hmm. It's not fair that the uh, the enemies can touch the flowers. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Yep. 
And then you can just warp out by touching the flowers. Yep. Hup. <laughs> Done. Hmm, that's a big tree. I'm starting to think maybe you should just warp to some other place that has a nice vantage point to yeah. look for this shit. Damn it. Um. Go over here. Yeah, yeah. So once we get these five, uh, these three remaining Korok seeds, is that the stream? Ugh, I guess. Don't want it to be. <laughs> My, I understand you're sleepy, right? I'm a little sleepy. Yeah. Yeah, war you gotta go somewhere with like ruins or something. Mm hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Is that a chest or a rock? That's a chest. Oh, there's got to be a Korok. Mm. Oh, Korok. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here we go. They love hanging out on mountains. Mm -hmm. They love putting their little tasks on the mountains. Hooray. <gasps> oh, God. You thought it was going to go into the water or something? I thought it was going to, like, hop over that. Yeah. There's two left. To left. Yeah. Oh, damn. We feasting. <laughs> no. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Mm hmm. One left. <laughs> Drop it on his head. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Boop that snoot. Yeah. Sure did. <laughs> um, hmm. The way you're facing. Mm -hmm. Is that tree down there? Oh, that tree is yeah, something. That's yeah, a, that's a thing. It's also a memory, I think. Uh, I think get, you're right. That you get later. Oh, there's yeah. definitely one in there in that big fallen oh, over tree. Oh, yes, yes, yes. The, but you got to touch the flowers. Save it for later. Maybe mark a couple of these that are suspicious. Yeah. Uh, oh, I thought oh, this was the, an apple one. I thought it, uh, there oh. you go, there you go. Yeah. There you go. We're done. Uh, a little more to the left there. Yeah. Huh? Mm-hmm. Yup. There might be more than one in there, too. Probably. And I bet there's some down there, so you, yeah. you know, we can come back here next time we get the Korok thing. But that we're done with that one. Yep. Time to go back to Ganon. Do you do you want do you want to try one more run to Ganon? <sighs> Let's do one more attempt at Ganon. All right, last run. Change of task over there. Yep. Be right back. Uh huh. Okay. Oh. Let's 
see, should we just warp? Yeah, I really want to just get the, the warp that's in Hyrule Castle, if possible. So we'll, we'll try f start from that shrine one more time and uh, attempt to go through the back end and not get uh, murdered by a guardian this time. <laughs> Hello, Cass. Okay. We get Drivby. Um, so I think I need to go this basically the same route I attempted last time. But just stealth better. Good? No, I got my horse. <laughs> you were asking me earlier what uh, class and race I'm playing in Dungeons mm -hmm. and or Dragons. And I'm not going to tell you, but I did um, do a poll asking people what race they thought I would be playing yeah. in Dungeons and Dragons. The results were shocking. Uh, <laughs> no, I didn't know I had such tiefling energy, guys. Like, what is it? Yeah. What is it about me that screams tiefling? I hear there's a there's a predilection of tieflings uh, being bisexual, but is that the only thing? Mm. Yeah. Art kid, is that a thing? Hmm. Tieflings, uh, your 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 demon spawn art kids. Okay, I'm gonna try to get to that shrine underneath the castle again. But but why are tieflings for the gays? I don't disagree or anything, but I feel like everyone's pretty... The, the chances are pretty equal across most races, I think, of just having yeah. bisexual energy. Oh no, look out, man over there. It's a man. Okay, so issue is I don't remember where in the back gets you to that shrine. Yeah, so like basically I think I have to go further that yeah, this way. I right? remember being up by the timber line, basically. Whoa. Oh sloshing. I was wondering what that fucking sound was. <laughs> <laughs> uh okay. Hey, I'm going kind of the same way I did my very yeah, first run. Yeah, exactly the same entry point. Or second run. Oops, wrong run. An intersection of goth energy and queer kid. I guess. I guess. I guess. Misunderstood social outcasts, but also they're hot and colorful and upset Christians. Mm. Hmm. Also, well, thank you. <laughs> huh? I was saying, oh, thank you. <laughs> I am a misunderstood social outcast, but I'm hot <laughs> and colorful and upset Christians. Those are all very nice reads. Thank you. But I was very, I was very chuffed at how wrong mm -hmm. the guesses were. It's really great. My the the race I am actually playing was, uh, I think it was in the top seven. Yeah. Something like that. Uh, yes, one of the options is to get the Master Sword, but it only uh, is valid if you have 13, 13 hearts or more, because you cannot get it if you have less hearts than that. Yep. Hmm. I mean, it's like back there. Like, you're, you're better off back. getting back on your, like, going there and getting on your horse a little while. And like, w watching oh. the back of uh, the castle and seeing like well, where there's an entry point. Too late. <laughs> there is a glitch, but that's cheating. I don't know what this glitch is. 
Oh, for getting the Master Sword? Oh, oh, of course, there's probably a glitch for that. Over here? No, it's a waterfall, I think. Damn! That's the waterfall you saw earlier. No, oh. I mean, like, back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, hey! Mm. Get on there! Mm. It would have been very funny if you drowned on the, uh, in the moat. <laughs> that would definitely be let's go to bed. Oh, that would mode. be so funny though. Ooh, I should have stayed on my horse. Yeah. if I had a similar uh, poll to guess my my class I, also, I wonder if it would also be way off and it would be like okay mm. the sixth place thing out of 12 is somewhere in the middle is, is uh, the actual answer right let's all be worth it once Ganon's dead! <laughs> Is it really all the way over here? Damn. I fucked up. You can also, uh, you know, climb up the waterfall with, uh, yeah. with those of you. If that's something you feel like doing, you don't I, have to. I am getting sick of just doing this, though. Oh, you've done it for so long. Huh? But you've done it for so long. Getting a lot of warlocks. What, what, what's warlocky about me? Mm. <laughs> I don't even know how. I don't know how warlocks uh, work. Are they like sorcerers? Or are they like wizards? First time player's first magic user. Eh. D and D warlock class. What's what's so hot about them? Well, they have a pact with an otherworldly being. That is attractive. <laughs> that is fun. Oh, is Cordelia a warlock? Oh, a scale in here. What the? A what? A dragon scale in a chest? What? That's so weird. Huh. That's super weird. Pig Ganon walks so Dilf Ganondorf could run. <laughs> 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 they only get a handful of spells, but they also have permanent powers and finger beams. Ooh, well, that's lovely. A caster with weird spell slot rules. <laughs> Okay, she's a warlock, and Cheddar is her her patron. That 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 was right. <laughs> you get the single strongest cantrip in the game, and you can fire it forever. What is it? Oh, here it is. Oh my god! Also a fucking laser. Eldritch Blast. Hmm. Sounds pretty open Damn it. to you. This fucking guy is right here. Gotta wait for him to go back to bed. How? Hmm. Will he go back to bed? Yeah, just wait. Just like, he... Hmm. Just wait a little. Just wait. Just wait. I'll for wait. a little bit. <laughs> like a minute. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't... Mm. Only I can make a block from this high up. Mm. You can always drop last second. There you go. Oops. <laughs> Thank you. 
There we go. Okay. Is this it? I think this is it. Oh, yes it yeah. is. I was right. <laughs> There is another back entrance uh, through the du the dungeons, which is really neat. Yeah, too. the the little mine area. Yeah, I've, I've gone through there and here before. Yep. Both are fun. There's also another entrance that's really sneaky because it's not labeled as a doorway in the map. Mm. But wow. How is this guy not seeing you? <laughs> Along the side, just like one of the cliff faces, there's a very small bit that is broken open that leads into a jail cell. Yes, yes, that's what I'm talking about. I'm, ta I'm talking oh. about that. That's the dungeon entrance I was talking about. Oh, okay. Yeah, like jail entrance. Okay. Shrine time. I mean, my character kind of has a pack, but not... isn't a warlock. Halfway between having a patron and having a familiar, I guess, is the Leave situation. Me alone! What the? the Pentagon. Imagine that bat somehow killed me. I know that they don't do that, <laughs> that much would be damage, really, but really tragic. Yeah. What just blew up? It's lightning outside. Oh. There we go. Yeah, baby, we got a warp point. And you can start, and you can start the next stream trying again, maybe too. Mm -hmm. Bookend it with a Ganon attempt. Yeah. Regardless of where you left off last time. Let's not forget to actually touch it. Yeah, unless he makes it all the way and kills him now, obviously. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and this goes to the library. Yep, this is one of the secret bookcases. What a great level. Oh god, that would have been so <laughs> funny! <laughs> I would have screamed and woke up every neighbor. Uh-huh in this entire place. <laughs> that would have been so fucking funny. Oh, tongue. Fucking. This is regular mode, by the way, but yeah. we are babies. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving. Boop! Ooh, yeah, there's more guys up there. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I, was, I was also hoping he would steal the spear of the guy that dropped the spear, but I wasn't going to backseat him. Thank you. I don't want to waste a bomb arrow here. <laughs> <laughs> well, the challenge is hard, hun. Yeah, it sure is. Are you gonna see me? <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, that's weird, but all right. Oh, wow. Bang! <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Ooh, good shot. Thank you. Oh, you could have got his bow. Damn, that sucks. Fell down. <laughs> okay. Okay. He's dead. Gotta get that guy's bow. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. 
Now you might have a chance of headshotting this guy a little bit better. Mm -hmm. I don't want to kill this guy. I just want to leave. I do want to get those electric arrows, though. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Ah. Yep. Shit. Yep. So I need to get up over there. Hey. <laughs> uh, he might still have a bow and arrow. I don't know. Ooh, he, he can do that too. He spat at me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You gotta pick up more food. Generally. Mm hmm. Is, uh, did I see the thing you can shoot? Oh no, never mind. I don't know if there is a thing you can shoot for this. No, I, spot. I don't think. Uh, yeah, I, it's just in the the guardian beasts. Mm -hmm. All right, furthest so far. Nice ice sword. Look at that nice ice sword. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Cool. Contender. He's got bomb arrows on him. Ooh, say. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is one way to do it, I guess, but uh, mm -hmm. it's not a smart way to do it. <laughs> Drop any oh. explosive arrows, arrows though. Damn it! Dang. All right. I don't Is get the cut. kitchen near here? Cause that would be nice. Or the dining room, cause there's a fuckload of food in there. <laughs> Ooh, mid jump. <laughs> <laughs> How the hell? I don't have any. Oh! I'm gonna get hit. Roll! <laughs> you can't roll in this game, hon. <laughs> Lost all my temporary hearts. Hmm? <laughs> get up in his ass. Dark Souls. Steal his thing. Hey! Oh, he's already He's dead. just dead. Um. I do want to keep that torch, but... Get rid of these 12. You got two of them. There's a yeah, bomb Yeah, five. Though. Bundle. Oh, jeez. Oh, he's got a royal claymore on him, though. Oh, man, he immediately knew about you. Yep. Jeez. It's a oh, bunch of weapons the armory. in here, though. Yeah. You get armor in here, maybe. I don't think there's armor it's, in here. I thought there was, here. like, shields and shit. Maybe shields, but... Not armor, yeah, sorry. Okay. So I want him to drop his shit, first of all. Nice. And now... <laughs> yeah. There we go, there we go. 52. Oh, 
There we go. Okay. Fuck, fuck your life. <laughs> so a lot of rusted oh, shit. Oh, right, it's all rusted. Hey. Guard's bow is good, though. This isn't rusted, though. Mm-mm. There we fucking go. Yep. Another soldier's bow. Nice. <laughs> Woo! Mm-hmm. Damn. A lot of arrows in that All shit. All right. Dope. There's probably... Yeah. Like these 12s and 14s you can probably get rid of. Yeah. Seven. Seven. What? Nah. Throw that shit away. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. I'm still, I'm full. Looking good. Looking all right. Mm-hmm. There he goes, the little lad. There goes my hero. Watch him as he climbs. <laughs> Damn. Uh, nah. Something for the Octorox. Check them corners, Link. <laughs> oh. Hi. Act natural. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing suspicious here. <laughs> He's looking right at you. He looks at me, though, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? <laughs> you weirdo. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh, Who is she? Mm, mm, mm. I forget what this chest is, this DLC chest. Oh yeah. Oh, at least you look cute now. And it and it takes more damage, you know, you can take it's a little bit more. Slightly more, yeah. yeah. There you go. Oh, mm -hmm. you're so cute, look at you. You look like a little gentleman. <laughs> Damn. You look like Edward Elric. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this voice actor is not a gentleman. Don't misconstrue me. <laughs> Just an apple. Mm, I don't want to cross not, that guy's vision yeah. again. <laughs> I'm already chancing it so much already. Already playing with fire here. Now is this? Yeah. Mm, the dining room. The dining room. Lots of nude chickens here. Oh, jeez. Uh, Fuck this room. I forgot. Fuck this room. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's worth it for some raw chicken. There's like lots of bananas and shit in there, but... <laughs> A balanced meal. Raw chicken and bananas. Mm-hmm. No thanks. <laughs> There's too many guys to fight right now. That fucking sucks. Oh yeah, see a couple of those guys in there. Hey, who hit the thing? I like that. Hey, what the? Oh, hello. Yeah. Oof. Uh. This is such a good tactic. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, and he's got a big club. Yep.
Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's link time. <laughs> that chair, that couch looks so new. <laughs> mm. Hello? Got a royal spear though. Ooh. Where are you going? Hee <laughs> hee. Seeing a little stinker, Link. Spanked. Yay. <clears throat> Look how clean that couch is. What the hell? Oh, well, yeah. Why is it so clean? Everything else is, like, dumpy as hell in here. Looking good. There aren't even any stains on it. The Moblins keep those really nice because they are comfortable to sit on. <laughs> they really don't want to trash those. That's a Korok right there. Yep. Well, look who it is. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, this one's about to break oh, anyways. That broken one. There we fucking go. More arrows in the corner too. Uh, oh, ancient arrows. Yeah. Sick. I gotta be really precious with yeah. those. There's only fucking three of them. <laughs> Dope. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh. Bop! <laughs> oh, hey. Bop! Wow, I walked right past that. <laughs> yeah. Huh. All right, yeah. Okay, <laughs> so that's a no-go. Okay, where did that guy come from? Right oh, there. it's him. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Can you see me from here? Yep. Damn. This guy's an issue. Oh, there's that oh, guy too. Oh, it's him, it's actually. Yeah. Okay, so, so if it's this... him, can you can you uh, climb up the very very edge here? If it's that if it's that guy, if he's around the corner. Hmm. Yeah, climb come up here. I don't think he can see you here. Maybe. Yeah, you might. Yep, you're right. Yeah, yeah. The observant wife has logged on. Thank you, wife. <laughs> oh, this is so scary. Oh, no! Ah! Help me! <laughs> I'm Hiding! Stuck, stuck on the parapet. <laughs> okay, wow, we up in it. I'm getting slightly closer. <laughs> we up in Ganon's asshole, everybody. Oh, uh, there's so much goop here, though. Mm. Okay, I don't know if he's alive. He's dead. Yeah. Okay. Climb up those waterfalls. You could go down there. Yeah. But that's a lot of vantage points for guardians to kick your ass. Yeah. Inside seems nice, but... Yeah, there's frequently treasure chests in these like towers too. Oh, I know what that is. Oh, what is it? You walk in there, these gates shut, and you're forced oh, you to fight a Hinox, right? Uh, or something like that. There's a couple towers that do this. One of them has a Lionel in it. <laughs> so no, oh, that would have been funny. <laughs> I knew what the, was gonna happen if I walked in there. I ain't falling for that shit again. Wow, well done, hun. <laughs> Nothing gets past you. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the Lionel come from? Is he like suspended above in a cage? I don't remember. Okay, well, oh, crisis nice. averted. Yeah. Mm hmm. Nope. 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 Ah! Oh, oh. Climb from a different spot. Mm hmm. Oh, he spawns in like a Yiga assassin. Okay. He what? He spawns in like a Yiga. Oh, yeah. Just poofs in. That makes sense. Mm 
Link. <laughs> Link, my, my boy. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> the there. lighting is so cool up here. Yep. Hi. Oh, look who it is. A little doodad. It's a bad place to be, little guy. <laughs> yeah, haha, Jesus Christ, where am I? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Why the fuck did I hide here with my poop? Okay. <laughs> I'm thinking we glide here, climb up that waterfall, maybe? I don't think you can make that glide. I think I can make that glide. May well, yeah, maybe if you land in that lower area that has a yeah. bombable wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, you had it. Stamina-wise, no problem. Well, well yeah, ha, ha. Another doodad. Now that we're not looking for him, yep. we're tripping everywhere. We're tripping over him. You know, technically, uh, if you got the get five Korok seeds, you could go to Ganon's castle, run into five Koroks during it, and then yeah. go beat up Ganon. <laughs> oh, do 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 do! Haha! Not that way. No, uh, I don't know about that way. Well, that way's not so good either, but. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if that fucker's gonna see you climbing up the waterfall. Hmm. Mm, uh oh. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> Can't go up that waterfall because that. This guy's gonna see you. Like, yeah, this guy right yeah, there. Yeah, absolutely. He's gonna see you. Blast my ass. Blast my ass. <laughs> oh no. Speaking okay. of ass blasters. <laughs> <laughs> Different waterfall. Mm-hmm. Standing on these little edges. The I'm in danger line isn't actually in that episode? I don't- I think it- what? Not true. Ralph Wiggum doesn't say I'm in danger on the bus. <laughs> I, I swear. Is it a Family Guy? It's from the Family Guy crossover? Oh what? man, that makes it the, suck. The line or the screenshot? Probably both. Ooh, an angle. Diagonal. Diagonal! Alright, what's up? Whoa! <laughs> oh no. Hello? Hmm. <laughs> he ah crap he crouched never mind <laughs> oh my god oh my god <laughs> we're here time to die time to die <laughs> well that's the challenge thanks for watching <laughs> yeah right um when i'm done let's fucking go <laughs> Okay. Wow, what are you doing here, small fry? <laughs> Time for some blights. Scourge of who? <laughs> I don't know her. Wow, that tech. 
<laughs> I got stuck on the stairs. <laughs> Time to die real soon. You've got a you've got a stamina meat. Um, Down. No, I don't. I want to eat the thing with the defense boost. Oh. Okay. I don't know. I don't know your brain. <laughs> I saw the, the the steamed meat and I was like. Hey, Chat, I know that generally buffs, you can only have one at a time. Having the temporary hearts doesn't get rid of the defense up, right? Oh, I'm pretty yeah. sure it doesn't. I don't know. I'll see what the chat says. Nope. They can coexist. Okay. So we're both right, honey. Mm -hmm. The stairs. <laughs> I'm getting really fucked up on these goddamn stairs. Move the dang camera, son. this <laughs> shut up <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry god damn it <laughs> really fucking it up hon well I mean it's the first time you got here oh there are fuck <laughs> I keep getting tripped up on that the fucking stairs. spot I was curious if they would let me walk out, but no, there's those nah, like, yeah. walls. Illegal. Wow. <laughs> oh, shit. Bastard. Yep. I warned you about stairs, bro. <laughs> uh-huh. Well, okay, now that's the stream. That's the stream. I know there's a gimmick where you can, like, throw bombs into his tornado or something like that. Huh. Right? Well, I, I don't know. You you know more about this game than I do. <laughs> mm -hmm. Straight up. <laughs> Thanks well, for watching. Are you going to, like, teleport to uh, yeah. some other place? or? I think. Well... Or, or are you going to give him another go at the start of the next? I don't want to because I I need to get cheating. extra resources. You're oh, yeah, good. Because I have no armor. I have to get better food. Yeah. Absolutely. Which is why I'm really hoping <laughs> I roll, get some armor or something. Because holy fuck. Thanks for the you're pretty good bits, Garbage Nirvana. <laughs> I think you're pretty good. That was pretty good. Thank you. You got there. You got to the I got, room. Well, how, what was... What number attempt was that where I got finally got to the boss? Was that Three. my third? That's not bad. Three, but the second the second time in the castle, though. Oh, right. I okay. think. Were you in the castle three times or twice only? Because you on, on the way to the castle, you got ganked by somebody yeah. twice. You got ganked by... I think I was in the castle twice. Yeah, you got ganked by a guardian, and yeah. you got ganked by those two the, the goblins. The goblins, and yeah. I think you were in the castle twice. That's... Fucking cool that you yeah. made it to that room on the second try. That's ridiculous. Oh, <sighs> is this a? Do you want to spin the wheel now or later? Let's spin the wheel now. Let's see what's let's, in store. Let, that'll be the cliffhanger. The cliffhanger ending. All right, what are we gonna do? Uh... Oh Woo! my god, an extra heart! Hey! <laughs> Good shit, actually. Alright, we'll start the next stream getting an extra heart. <sighs> Alright, thanks for watching, everybody. I'm not sure when I'll stream this again next. Probably very soon. The wheel provides. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, wheel. <laughs> Thank you. Um... It's like you got a, like a heart piece from beating that guy. <laughs> it's uh -huh. like you got a reward for getting there. Yeah. Um, yeah, I was gonna say something else, but people like the stream, fun concepts, cool. enjoyable, 
uh, interesting. This is another word I'm seeing mm-hmm. thrown around. And yeah. Yeah, thanks. Cool, cool times. Yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you soon. I'll announce when we're doing another one of these. And mm-hmm. this will also be up on YouTube if you missed parts of it. If you missed the middle chunk where it was just me running for a long time to Spiral Jetty. <laughs> the good shit, yeah. <laughs> Breath of the Wheel. Breath of the Wheel. Breath of the Wheel. Wow. Ogre Battle. That's a good name. Breath of the Wheel is a good name. Yo, yeah. that's a, that's what it's called now, I think. Yep. <laughs> Breath of the Wheel of the Worst. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Thanks for that's watching, a, everybody. That's a feature, folks. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. We'll see you next stream where I do more of this shit. Yeah. We're going to raid somebody, I guess. But Oh, yeah. Goodbye, VOD. Goodbye.